whenever you fucking play a game like this, all right, whenever you fucking even say at all, yeah, I'm going to play like fucking this weird sandbox murder game. You'll get someone that comes out of the woodworks and, and is just like, I find it really fucking relaxing to crush the things in this game with a 1,000 pound metal slab as I watch as the life is squeezed from their fucking eyes. I'm like, dude, fucking chill out. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> I like, I like just turning on the game and ripping someone's fucking head off. I mean, I'm not one to talk. I would, uh, when I was, when I was trying to find stuff to zen out in, uh, I, I genuinely played a lot of blade and uh, sorcery or whatever it's called, and I'd huck a lot of people into a lot of things. And that'd make me feel a lot better. You know, I would just grab someone and throw them, and I'd be like, "This is, this is nice." As they like scream, and I like physically rip their heads off. Like, so that was. There's something nice about that too. I get it. But isn't that the point? No, the point is to feel like the point is to feel some sort of dread or shame for taking lives. Chat, you sickos! Look at what violent video games have done to you, brother. Look at what violent wanton destruction in video games has done to you, done to our society, brother. Also, yeah, D. Colin is uh, outlawed uh, for this one. Possibly forever. I'm so sick of you guys feeling bad for things in video games. You're bringing a toxic energy into the stream and I won't have it. I won't let you do it anymore. D colon isn't toxic. Oh, it's toxic. If I do something fucking funny to someone and, and I look over there and what I get is an LOL Omega LOL LMAO or, you know, one of those. And instead I see D Collins, I'm like, what the fuck? I'm being gaslit into thinking it's not funny, even though it was fucking funny when I shot that person in the street in the video game. That was fucking funny. And now people are gaslighting me, you know? <laughs> People are, it's a, it's a, it's a manipulative emote. Chat, you gotta understand, the colon is a manipulative emote used by psychos, okay? And it's canceled, I'm canceling it. You are so funny, D colon. It's toxic false pity, I know, and that's even worse. Cause like, when instead I come on and say, hey guys, so I walked outside today and a big elephant grabbed my arm and ripped it right off with his wacky nose, ripped it, ripped it clean off. I'm, I'm missing an arm now so I can only play certain video games. Please, I would be like, D colon. I, I'd be like, my, my, my arm is gone though. D colon, D colon. Pepe hands. And that's the Pepe hands I would say is just as bad. Poor elephant. What did you do to that elephant? <laughs> Dude. <laughs> There's like a there is a fucking demographic of people that if a fucking wild like elephant broke out of a zoo in like the middle of Massachusetts, ran to my house, ripped my arms off, and then like just walked away. People would be like, it's your fault for antagonizing him. <laughs> Why did you do that? Why did you scare him? I'm like, he broke into my house, went directly for my arms. <laughs> it's in distress. <laughs> he was distressed. He also wrote on a wall, I am a bad elephant this time. Uh, and then an angry face. Does that change anything? If on the wall it has written this time, like I'm bad this time, where people be like, he's having a bad day is what that means. We can't hold it against him. <laughs> You're killing him. Stop it. 
it was a defense mechanism. Okay, but like, what if you, what if you're like, for, what if you're watching this? Like, you're a neighbor. You look out your window. You see the elephant has climbed into my room to get me. And I'm trying to run away. I run into a room that it can't reach. And you see as it like bends down and sends its nose in after me. And it hauls me out and then rips my arms off. Then is it like, are you still like, you're stressing? He's stressing, obviously, Tomato's stressing him out somehow. Or antagonizing it. But like I'm I'm screaming and just trying to get away as fast as I can. And the elephant like fucking sent its nose in to get me. Stop running away, you monster. Play with him. <laughs> Play with him now. Stop avoiding them. He's more scared of you. <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. He was probably more scared of me, and that's why the only way he could get rid of that fear was to rip my arms off so I couldn't hurt him. He doesn't know any better. Oh, they know better. All right, no trumpet for this elephant bit. I'm not doing that. I'm not, I'm not a clown. I, I, dude, I don't want to be made. Of, I don't want to look like such an idiot anymore on stream. I changed my mind. I want to, I'm turning, I'm, I'm turning from heel to face chat. All right, I'm turning into a, a guy really everyone can root for. I'm, I'm done being the clown. I got a call from the producers. They said they said that they said that people just think I'm an ass. They don't think it's even like I I want to be I want I want people to fucking you know really connect with me. You know I want I want I want to like get through to people in like a really you know touching and emotional way. And I can't do that when whenever I say something it's met with "fuck you asshole idiot Omega lol you're a dumbass go to hell." Uh, whenever I say anything. Uh, I can't, I can't build a brand like this. This is like the first hour of the Joker. I mean, look, dude, everyone talks about having their Joker moments nowadays. And like, let's be honest. Like I, I've looked over at chat enough times and seen enough fucking unbelievable shit go by when I've been genuinely trying to say something that like I've had about 20 to 30 Joker moments in like the last week. All right, I'm still standing. I'm here. I'm, everything's good. Something, something, society. Tomato, guys, I'm the Joker gaming. <laughs> guys, when you really think about it, I'm just like the Joker, man. If you really fucking think about it. Face turn, by the way. <laughs> look at chat. All I gotta do is, like, get someone to look worse than me. You know, like, bring, like, someone in. Someone that'll, like, very easily fall for anything. And make them look like an asshole. <laughs> yeah, just fucking bring him in. Lead him on to say some bullshit and then be like, I can't believe you just said that. Why would you say that to all these people? I'm done letting you push my chat around. Don't worry, chat. I'll defend you. And then, you know, I turn face and everyone's like, oh, my God, he's a hero of the people. He's changed. I hate this other person now. I, I genuinely couldn't do that, chat. There's like a nine out of ten. Nine out of ten times, you guys get what's coming to you. <laughs> All right, and the one out of ten, I'll admit, is sometimes a fucking, you know, that's a bit of an oops. But nine out of ten times, you, you have what's coming to you.
That's for something you'll do later. Look, I think that's a fair punishment. I think that's a pretty fair way to do punishments around here, to be honest. Like, I know some of, some of you people, I've seen the things you say. You're gonna do something. Eventually, eventually you're gonna fucking do something I can tell a mile away. So, if I, if I get you now, then you're, you've already gotten the punishment out of the way for later. And I promise I'll be like, ah, I already got you. Don't worry, you can say that unbelievable crap now. Get your pun get your punishment out early. Like go to prison and say, excuse me, sir, I'm going to do a murder. Can I do my time now? So I have a free murder when I need to do it in like 20, 30 years? Uh Yeah, I guess. Cool. That'd be dude, that'd be pretty wild. Like what if they were just like, yeah, I I guess just we won't get you. We, we won't get you for it, I guess. Can I do prison in time? Can I do prison time in installment? The king of Sweden is not bound by law. Does Sweden have a king? I thought I don't know anything about Sweden at all. Basically. No. Yes. Yes, no. Oh, yikes. It's really embarrassing because it's one of the first times I've seen an almost unanimous yes. And the one fucking guy who said no, I know who you are. Owned. Look like a real fool out here now. That was actually a shockingly unanimous yes for chat. Way more unanimous than usual. Did you see that Nickelodeon Smash Brothers? They already had one of those in like 2002 and it was terrible. It literally, oh, that already basically existed. So I guess you played like basketball on that one. So really, not really. But there, there was already sort of games like that. Now, honestly, like some of the people in Nicktoons stuff is just cheating anyways. So it wouldn't really be fair to put them against each other. And like Smash Brothers, everyone's sort of equal. Aside from, like, Snake, who has guns, which is crazy. But, like, aside from him, everyone's pretty equal. And then you have, like, Danny Phantom, who is essentially God. Like, I'm... Dude, I'm not fighting that guy. You put me in an arena with that guy? Yeah, right. Jimmy Neutron creates a nuke. Well, Jimmy Neutron's got a big fucking target on him, all right? He's got a big head. Okay, that's the thing is that no one ever tried pushing him over. I bet he's top heavy. I bet he can't. Can, did he ever fall over ever in the entire show? Because I feel like he's got like a fucking situation where he won't be able to get back up. His head's gigantic. Like, actually, do the math. It's like more mass than his body. I just aim for his head. <laughs> you want to get rid of Jimmy Neutron? It's not that hard. All right, I'm not. I'm not a psycho. Okay, I'm just saying. I'm. I'm just saying. Jimmy Neutron is dollar store Dexter from Dexter's Lab. Change my mind. Well, no. The difference is that Jimmy Neutron had friends, and Dexter was depressingly alone. So there is a slight difference there. Dexter was like fucking depressingly alone. He had Mandark. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I guess he did, chat. Se Mandark was more of a fucking antagonist, if I remember. Not really a friend. That's sort of a reach. That's like calling your fucking like weird bully like a, a, a friend. Like a fucking... Stockholm Syndrome's like scenario. Man dark. Oh my God. <laughs> Dexter had like Dee Dee or that monkey. I 
don't even remember anything about this show. I, I was it Dee Dee, his sister, and I don't remember the monkey at all. The only monkey I remember was J Mojo Jojo, who was a different uh, series. I don't remember a monkey. There was a dog in one episode. If there's only, if they're only around for one episode, they're not a friend. This kid had no friends, dude. This kid had no friends. He had all this fucking power, all this technology, but yet he couldn't make a friend, which is so sad. Sad. Genuine friendlet. Yeah, I mean, to be honest, if I had the if I had a fucking sprawling city beneath my house that I built, I would probably not concern myself with friends either, to be honest. He made a robot brother who lives on the moon tomato. Okay, chat, that means nothing. <laughs> He, that one, that one lives on the moon. Two, he made it. Okay. He had people he played D&D &D with. How'd that go? Because I saw another person saying he was a very bad DM. How'd that go for him? Because it sounds like they hated him. I'm not surprised. He cheated. He cheated as a DM? What are you talking about? How do you? I don't, I don't know. I've never met a DM in my whole life that wanted to win. He rolled the dice and then lied. He's. Isn't the whole. Isn't like sort of the point of DMing that you want your players to live to some extent because you get to tell your story if they live? <laughs> Isn't that sort of like the point of DMing is that you d you want the fucking main characters that drive your plot to live and have fun deliberately? Dude, if I'm making a fucking D&D &D campaign, dude, I want to win. Okay, no offense or thoughts about it. I want to win. I don't give a fuck. I, I'm going to win. <laughs> I'm gonna own them. Dude, I'm gonna make these people make entire goddamn character. I'm gonna tell them that they need to even design their like extended family of characters. And then I'm gonna kill them on day one. I'm gonna own them. I'm gonna win so goddamn hard. And when they die, I'm going to say, I win. And they're going to never talk to me again. And oh, I will be so powerful. I'll be so powerful. You know what I mean? I win. <laughs> it's so... <laughs> I win. You lose. You never beat me. I wonder what kind of campaign Tomato would do as a DM. I don't know. Because I probably won't ever DM because I don't have the time to do that. Because I'd want to do it well. And I have all these comparisons of like extremely good DMs that have done it well that I would want to do something comparable and I'll never have the time to do something comparable to the crap that they do. So it'll probably never happen. Ever. Ever. Run a one shot. Even that. Because my logic is if something's a one shot, it better be really fucking good. And, uh, you know. No, no, no. No, I don't think so. More like bluff stream D colon. Look, chat. The, the, 
the law is on their way. Okay. The law is on its way to take you down. Don't you worry. We're sending them. It's not an instant process, but in a couple of minutes, they're going to be there to take you in. My last GM almost killed me and my entire party by having level 2 characters fight a suit of armor with 18 AC and multi-attack, and then right after a dragon that did 40 damage to me on our very first quest, but you lived, didn't you? Look, chat, I've had, I've had some, I've been in some pretty dire D&D scenarios, but typically I assume that uh, both of the DMs I've played with, well, all three technically have done stuff with Joe as well, um, have balanced it in such a way that even if it fucking sucks out there, there is a way to get out uh, or a way to win. Like fucking hell with the worm fight we're doing in Goblins, uh, we could just bug out. We've done it a lot. We could easily bug out again. It wouldn't be that fucking hard. At least for me, I have fucking greater invisibility. If I want to leave, I'm out. Like, they're not catching me. I have multiple slots of greater invisibility. Like, e players leaving combat is super rare. Well, that's because players want XP and milestones. But you know what sucks more than, uh, uh you know, leaving? Dying. Forever. Having to st roll a new character. I'm like, fucking hell, man. That's That would suck. Just don't die. I've never died. I mean, I've gone down like a sack of bricks in D&D. I think everyone that's played it has gone down at least once. But I would say at least as far as I'm concerned with like at least Clurnt, I'm very, I, I get his whole deal. And it's pretty easy for me to just like stay out of fights because my entire team is melee, but me? So I don't really get threatened as Goblin ever, really. I'm almost always in the like the far back. Oh my god, I'm seeing some real fucking cursed D D messages. You guys gotta find like D DMs that are normal, or at least like sane a little. Have you played a no monk tomato? Lol monk man. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Lol monk man. I'm not playing a goddamn monk. Ew. <laughs> I had to watch that. I, I had to be there with a better character for that. I'm not gonna play a monk. <laughs> I'll play anything else. Monks are OP though. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, maybe like level 10. Maybe like a year and a half. Just because Kenji is a lol monk doesn't mean all monks are bad. I don't know. I've seen other monks. <laughs> I've seen the other ones, and none of them. No offense. It's not their not not the person piloting them's fault. Uh, they're, they're not. They don't seem very good so far. Look, all I'm saying is if I had to choose between like having a monk there in that spot or having like a second, and this isn't like an insult to Kenji, I'm because I love Kenji's character. But if I had to choose between having a monk there or a second, uh, Jean, I know which one I'm picking. <laughs> like, it's always just like, now pick one of the two. Like, you have to pick either we make another one of this guy or we take a, you have a low monk. I mean, really, I don't want low monk. Good news is, good news is, dude, as far as Shrine of Sin was concerned, we were the RP rollers, and any in combat required roll for anything at any point was met with complete failure. So I just, like, assume, <clears throat> I've learned my lesson, and, like, whenever we play again, I am absolutely 100% 
just going to try to avoid every single fight like like my life depends on it because it probably does because we can't get we can only get RP rolls so I'm just gonna avoid I'm gonna do whatever it can, whatever it takes okay there's no way I'm there's no way we survive even one more fight in that game but you hit like a tank yeah if I hit a lot of our characters hit hard if we hit, which we don't. That's why all my stuff with uh, Clern, none of it is hit chance, which is super nice. None of every cast I do with Clern deliberately is something that has to be a saving throw for the enemy. And I can debuff that. You know, that's a lot easier for me to fucking deal with. I don't know. I can't crit though i don't need to crit dude the rest of my team does so much fucking damage clarent is the fucking uh support aoe that's why i have all the aoe moves i'm not the only one that does anything I'm, I'm like the only utility our team has on goblins i am the utility i mean fucking hell me Cl confusion won us fight like actually saved lives i i that was the best spell I ever took in D&D was Confusion. Oh my god. So did sleep? Nah, sleep was never as good. So that, that fight with the fucking kobolds, we would have won either way. Because it was designed to be fought. But Confusion, dude? That saved Cheezel from instant death. Like two different times. Possibly three different times, honestly. How did Veep die? Who's Veep? Veep? The hell is Veep? <laughs> R.I.P. Veep, man. You know, Veep. I don't know Veep. That's the problem. But they are dead. I can only assume. Look, I'll just look it up on Google. Is Veep dead? Is Veep over for good? Yes. I think Veep in this case is a show on HBO. But um, Veep is dead. Apparently. Over for good. This guy's done for good. Goodbye, Veep. Ugh. I've been surviving exclusively off of water today, chat. I woke, I woke up on a fucking REM. Like in the middle of deep sleep, chat. I fucked up something, I guess, because I got seven hours flat, and that was the middle of like the... Oh, you should be sleeping right now. According to my body, so now I'm like a zombie today. And I'm not waking up. Oh, you know what? Nothing I do wakes me up properly. I am in the fucking, I'm in the state, the bad state. You know what I mean? Nice rim cycle, buddy. Shut up. Look, man, it doesn't matter, okay? I do most of my streams quite like sleepy. <laughs> I, I spend almost every stream half asleep. You guys haven't seen me do a good stream in years. Because every stream I'm asleep. I haven't been conscious for a stream since like 2017. We can tell. No, you can't. Oh, so that's why the one to two hours of pre-show exists. Yes. In some cases, yes. If I turned on my game right now and tried to actually commentate over it, you guys wouldn't get anything. <laughs> you wouldn't get fucking anything. You'd be like, what the fuck is wrong with the streamer? Why isn't he? Just be awake, lol. Look, if you, you know, you know what I'm talking about. Sometimes you just have a day where you wake up and you are sleepy all day. The whole time. You know?
So I don't even, I can't. I have a five hour energy. I'm going to get through this by drinking this poison, which I look at the nutrients on the back and some of you guys are like, this is death. What you're drinking is death and I don't see it. It says here something about caffeine, purified water, that sounds healthy. Natural and artificial flavors. Okay, that's not as good. Sucralose, potassium, sorbet. It's fine. It'll take approximately five months of your lifespan. Dude, I'll worry about that in the last five months of my lifespan, okay? I'll worry about that in the last five months of my lifespan. So tomorrow? Oh God, I was half through the sip when you said that. I don't fucking know. Trad, I was in the middle, I was hanging out with like Arcadum on his stream yesterday for a little bit. And I shit you not, being on it like aged me like 20 years. My back started hurting so bad over the course of like five minutes. I, I was screaming. I, I, I was trying to play it cool because I didn't want to like be rude while hanging out with my, with my, with Arcadum. And, uh, dude. I was, I woke up today, couldn't move. And I still, I'm still, I'm not bending in any direction at all. I'm not doing it. I'm like, bottom of my pack is locked down. This is a fucking, this thing's locked down hard. It's done. Dramatic, bro. <laughs> dude. Dude, okay. I've lived with with bad back lumbago for years, okay? For years. For ye I I have been the real lumbago guy this whole time. And for some reason, yesterday, while like sitting at my chair just talking, my body just was like, "Oh, we're done." All right. I got terminal lumbago, Arthur. Is tomato 24 or 64? I feel like 64 sometimes. I feel, I sort of feel like it. But yeah, I had, I had fun hanging out last night. I'm happy stuff's uh, working out for Arcadum and he's getting cool opportunities. It's cool shit. Everyone else there though, uh, <laughs> I didn't know, dude. I'm always happy to meet new people, dude. It's I don't I don't ha I don't talk to a lot of like new people because it's not like it's not really in my uh it's not really in my in my I don't I I just don't seek out crap like that. So it's always like some people I bump into, you know. It's just like everyone's so nice, dude. I'm I'm lucky that whenever I meet new people, I haven't met a single weirdo in a long time. That's all. Yeah. Yeah. I thought you hated people. I don't hate people, but I definitely am done with most people after about two hours of being around them. That's why I don't do multiplayer streams for more than about two to three hours. Because I've had enough of them. Like yesterday. I had enough of them. I, I That's why I was leaving. I was like, I don't want to see them anymore for another week. I'm done. There's nothing more to talk about. I hate them again. No, I left. Like, that's why, I, that's why I don't do many trips. Uh, as much as I'll probably go on a trip whenever there's, like, another convention that everyone's, like, going to just because I feel like, now I have to. It's been, like, the apocalypse is starting to sort of wrap up, maybe. Something will throw it back on course again. But for a little bit, it's starting to look like it might wrap up, maybe, by the year, like, 2023. And when that happens, I'll probably go on a trip. And uh, I'll be able to hang around everyone for about a day and a half. And then I'll... Say, all right, it's been a pleasure, and they'll say, where are, you, where are you going? Oh, to my Airbnb, where I'm going to remain for the next two to three days of this trip, alone, without any of you. And I'll say, well, that doesn't sound like you're really using your trip very well. And I'll say, oh, I've gotten as much as I need. No, no. Don't try to contact me again. There won't be anyone answering that phone. Go visit Arcadum, you coward. Dude, I'd visit anyone if I had the time or if it wasn't again. I'm not, look guys, 
I I know like shit with the virus is sort of in a fluctuant weird phase right now. I as much, I would love to pack up my bags and go see any of my friends. Like genuinely. Not happening though. <laughs> Not happening though. You'll have to fucking break my legs to haul me onto that plane. You'll have to break my legs and fucking throw me in a bag. Cause that's the only way you're getting me on that plane. I will go kicking and screaming. It's just not happening. What if you drove to Cricket? I'm chat. I can drive three hours and I'm done. I could drive to New York or like I could drive to the end of like maybe like I could drive to the start of Maine. Like I, that's my distance is like basically how like that it's that it's about it's about 150 miles. If it's further than that, I ain't even doing it anymore. Like I'm I need to I can't. I can drive seven hours. Dude, I don't have any fucking car endurance. Because again, tall guy. I get I drive from Western Mass to Boston and I say, well, that was a good expedition. And then I I'm done. I'm done for a while. I'm not a big I'm not a big travel guy. I I, I need at the very least the only way I could do it is if I uh fucking take a bunch of medicine to knock myself unconscious you know i only like playing long driving games i don't like doing it in real life you know what the hell happened hang on sorry i was trying to open something behind the wheel i mean if someone else is driving i can travel a long time I just don't like driving. I'm not I'm not huge into driving, chat. Like to be honest, I I do not drive very often. I have my license, I can legally do it. I just don't really like doing it because I have very little trust for other people on the road if I'm being honest. Um I trust my own driving, but I'm deeply I'm always pr Massachusetts has some fucking wild, crazy, aggressive drivers out here. Okay? It's an insane madhouse. I don't like going out there. I I've, I just don't. I can handle like rural areas where there's like, where everyone is sort of chill. But the second I can see more than two buildings. <laughs> no, no, I took a wrong turn. I took a wrong turn or something. That's why the rest of New England calls us mass holes. Yeah. Yeah. My brother exploded his engine while going 120. So I can see why you don't trust other drivers. Chad, I'm that guy who goes 40 and is like, whoa. Let's calm down now, engine. This is about as fast as we're going. Don't you worry about it. That's me. I'll, when I'm on a highway, I'll do like 65. And like, if there's someone behind me, that uh, peer pressure is the only way I speed up. Is like, if someone's like behind me trying to go fast, I'll be like, all right, only because you're making me. And then I'll like, the second they're gone, I'm back down to normal. I only, I only speed up because I don't want to like be the asshole. All right, I'm kicking it up to 66 just for you. <laughs> Do you think your standards for your streams are too high? I love them, and I think you shouldn't feel need to drink a five-hour energy to be amusing. This isn't a standards thing, my friend. <laughs> this is a, I have to drink something, or I will fall asleep on the stream. That's not standards. That's like walking into my job and passing out on the ground because I'm like not awake. There's a difference. But I appreciate the concern. I'm just tired. <laughs> like I'm not, this isn't like a, I, this isn't like when you drink alcohol to be like, dude, I, I gotta, if I'm gonna be funny, I gotta have my funny juice. Like this isn't that. Caffeine's not my funny juice. I'm, I need, 
I need it so I can actually make a cognizant sentence. There's a difference. <laughs> I, I need it. I need it. I don't have a problem. I, do, I don't. It's not my funny juice, okay? Addict. <laughs> Chat. I look. Sometimes I wake up with seven hours of sleep and I'm good. But I think what's really happening is I'm waking up with like six and a half hours of sleep. And that's, I guess, like my window where I'm like, good, good. Because I just wake up sometimes in this hour window and everything's fucked. And every, it happens to everyone. It's not a big deal. I'm fine. I'm fine. It's not a big deal. He's dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. Doesn't have long to live. I just saw a real fucking bad message in the chat. I'm not gonna read it, but people can tell what it was, okay? You are, you're gonna regret that. Dude, who even drinks apple juice in 2021, man? Like, if that is for, all right, this is gonna, apple juice is for fucking children, okay? You drink cider, all right? I see someone. I see someone ordering the goddamn apple juice. I'm, I'm, I, I, I'm gonna look at them and be like, "Get some goddamn apple cider, you freak!" What is your deal? We don't do that anymore. We don't. We don't do that anymore. Hard apple cider is good, dude. Hard anything is pretty good, okay? Because it, it, it's got alcohol in it. Like, you, <laughs> that's not really fair. It's just like putting alcohol in anything, and your brain's gonna be like, "This is pretty good, man." I don't, I don't know why, why hard water. Yeah, I made this hard water. If anyone wants any. Why isn't orange cider a thing? I mean, orange juice is basically orange cider. Like, that, it, or, that's pulp. You know? That's just pu orange juice with pulp. I gotta take a gigantic uh, bathroom break. I'll be right back. fucking happened this can't <laughs> this can't be happening again oh uh, this is gonna be a grim fucking stream now this one's gonna get sad at some point chat no it's not the spider about quarterly i get a mouse in my room just quarterly one finds its way in from some fucking like wormhole i just saw him again it's the quarterly mouse <laughs> It's cursed because I fucking talked about it last night on Arcadium Stream and now it's fucking happened again. Chat, this time it's not gonna be as funny though. Cause this time I was like, well, if they, I put down so many like things, I got like one of those things that like sends like sound waves or something that mice don't like that bounce around the room to like get them, keep them out of here. And I was like, no mice are gonna come back in here again. I think I found the hole. Guys, if it got in, that means it probably smells the the things, the, the traps. 
I need to get rid of these traps. I'm not gonna let it die while I'm streaming. I, I need to like, hang on. I need to actually go and pick these things up. I gotta get this thing out of here. I, could, I can't do it anymore. I can't. I can't. You guys are gonna hear like the sound of a snap and then you're gonna hear me scream. The sound things don't work, they're a scam. Well, I mean, this one's this one didn't come in as fast as some of the other ones have come in, so I don't know if that's true. The stream's canceled? The stream's not canceled, all right? I just, I'm not sure. Just look, chat, some of these fucking mouse traps are in. Look, okay. I, I just don't, I just don't like having to hear it happen. Okay, I'm not like a fucking angel. All right, these mice are entering my zone. I don't feel too bad for them, if I'm being totally honest. But what I don't like is having to hear this exact fucking moment when they were snuffed out and then knowing that I have to like, go get that later. Like, I don't want to have to stop the stream and be like, oh, and like stand up and have everyone have that documented as the moment that like my life was ruined, you know? Maybe it'll, maybe it'll, maybe he was just checking out the zone and then it saw me and it said, this ain't, I'm not vibing with this. And they got back in, in, in the hole. You know what I mean? Maybe, maybe it's that easy. Clip the live murder of cheese. What a lovely, what a lovely <laughs> snap. Cheese to meet you, snap. Stop it, <laughs> stop, stop. Stop, <laughs> stop it, stop it, you're ruining cheese. Cheese to be. Huh. <laughs> And not so cheesed anymore. <laughs> nice food that you have. Dude, I don't want to do it. I'm deactivating the one near me. I can't. Hang on, I'm turning it off. All right, I got it. I, I, and by turning it off, I mean, I put them like on like the fucking on like a shelf so that I can't I, at least they won't be right next to me. Cheesed emote when? What are you? What are you talking about? What? Where? Cheesed emote when? <laughs> it's already... Never refresh Pepe hands. <laughs> Never refresh Pepe hands. I agree. Give us cheese. Never refreshed copium. That guy's still on the copium train. He didn't. He hasn't refreshed since copium, so he can still use it. He see. He's the last fucking. He's the last one. Oh my god. I still have Granny Cream's hot butter. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, that's fucking good shit, man. What the hell? That's a that's the only true true viewer. The rest of you? The rest of you suck. None of you are as good as that guy. Not in a million years. That's only real one. The rest of you faking it. I'm leaving. Get out. Think I'm gonna stop you? Rat trap tier list? Dude, all right, there are some tier lists out there where you're just like the person who made this and anyone that tier lists this are insane. 
Yeah, I'm making a tier list for the best ways to uh, kill a, a rat or mouse. Uh, some really crazy stuff here. Uh, I'm gonna go through them one at a time and figure out which one's the best. Glue traps are cursed as hell? Yeah, no, I'm not. Look, chat. Just, uh, just don't live anywhere near where rats live. Don't be mean. You'll be fine. Just don't ever. There are places where rats aren't allowed. I, kn I know it to be true. There, there are places where rats are not allowed. Just get a cat. Chat, if my cat was in here, if one of my two cats was hanging out in this place, you think for God, I don't think for a second... They would even bat an eye at this little intruder, this 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 bastard. They wouldn't even they wouldn't even bother. I live in Alberta. We have a zero rat population. You can see it on an infographic map. Do you trust every infographic map you see though? Oh, my dog is barking. I think the rat went up. I think the mouse went upstairs. Oh no, that's my that's my delivery. That's my that's my delivery. My delivery's here. Oh my god, my delivery's here. I just bought a fucking gun to take down this rat. They didn't even ask for any of my information. I just got one. This mouse is going down. I'm not playing around, chat, because it actually had a T-shirt on that said "I'm evil." Uh, when it came in, I saw it. So I bought a I bought a firearm. That is someone put it on him, put the t-shirt on him, and it's a setup. But I, I'm not taking that shit. Just like the elephant. I stand by the elephant statement, dude. If I got if anything like oh my god, there's an endangered animal escaped from the zoo. And then someone just filmed it breaking into my house and attacking me. Like, oh, you can, you film, you, someone's filming it on their, like, camera, their, like, cell phone. They zoom in, you can see the fucking, like, rare, like, I don't know, like a blue-footed booby or something picking the lock of my front door. Oh, uh, look, it's a, it's a extremely endangered animal, pick, like, picking the lock of this person's house and breaking in. And it uh, looks like they're actually attacking and killing them. Uh, people would be like, I can't believe that guy fucking startled and scared that animal. He had it coming. You're killing it! <laughs> You're killing it! Blue-footed booby, though, dude. Who named that? <laughs> I mean, this is like the this low-hanging fruit is rotten on the ground, but I, I, who gave? Dude, that's like the shit where you like ask a bunch of people publicly, like online. Hey, we're gonna let you guys vote what we name this one, right? That that is that is one of like the public sourced names, right? Yeah, booby. Name it, name it booby. Bodie McBoatface. They never did that, right? They like that. They, they they never did it though. They that was one of those ones where they took the thing and they were like, yeah, uh, we're not actually doing that. You guys ruined it. Oh, they did. Yikes. Yikes. That's embarrassing. Well, that's the last one they ever did. That's the, la that's the last time they ever made that mistake. Ever again. Man. Oh my god. I need I need more caffeine. I might need an- uh, Chat, I'm- I'm gonna blow up. I'm gonna explode today. This is a bad scene. I'm actually gonna blow up. It's all the dew. I think dew would wake me up faster than caffeine would because it's got sugar in it. But I don't want to crash. I don't even have dew in the house. I, 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 I chased away the last person who tried to bring dew into this house.
we'll probably just have to switch to the game soon so I can like see if that wakes me up. Because evidently talking to you guys is sending me to Snortown. I got nothing to say. Same. I know. I know, right, Jack? These guys suck. <laughs> I thought I said it was outlawed! Adding more people to the list. I'm calling the police on all of you later. Anyone that's doing it outlawed, it's outlawed. You can't. Would you ever do stand-up? No. No. That is, I am not good at that. I would never do that. That's absolutely, I am not that. No, that would, that would be, that would be awful. I can even say that would be awful. You suck at improv. <laughs> uh. <laughs> he was right. People don't go do stand up. Guys, stand up is an improv. <laughs> stand people that do stand up, like have a set. Like that's, that's written stuff. <laughs> I'm standing up right now. <laughs> that fucking chat member is the is the best one we got out here, huh? That's grim. That's the bar. That's all we had. I was expecting someone to say something, like anything good, and that was all we could get. That was it. Tomato was literally a stand-up program. The, the intro every day is a stand-up program? No, the intro, chat, the intros, the intro hinges entirely on what I did yesterday, okay? That's like what, that's what impacts how funny the intro is, is based entirely off of did I do anything yesterday? And does anyone say something insane? Like, that's it. All right, none of that's like stand-up. I'm not like coming out with like a fucking plan. There's nothing. What's up with airplay? <laughs> you guys, you fucking guys, come on. What do you call a bear with no teeth? A gummy bear? Don't laugh. What about the scripts you and Dave make? I mean, I script most of my streams with everyone. That's normal. Most of the stuff we do is completely like predetermined. It's not pre-recorded, but we, we rehearse, we practice, it's all fake. Any streamer that tells you otherwise is lying. They're lying to you. The amount of times that I've gone off script and like someone like Charborg fucking emails me on our like private, you know, work emails and it's like, you fucking seriously dropped the ball again. I'm gonna have to tell the boss. I say, don't do that. He's like, you weren't supposed to, you weren't supposed to do that. You were supposed to do this. You were supposed to make an Among Us joke last night and you didn't. You're the only one, everyone else made Among Us jokes and you didn't. He sends me that kind of crap. And then I have to go to the boss's office and explain to him why I didn't do it. And, and the, usually the excuse is just that I, I have fucking bad brain and I can't remember anything. And he says, I'm firing you. I'm going to replace you with a different person. Hang on, how many fucking numbers are we at with some of these goddamn chat names? You, Rico, the, Rico, Rico, no, no, I'm not gonna let it slide, Rico. Rico, 65610854364878084737. This account's been here since 2017, Rico! I was like, oh, this guy got in trouble so many times. <laughs> He's been here for fucking so long. How, 
How do you? What's the? I Rico, I gotta know. I I actually need to know. Like one, where did it come from? What and how do you remember it? Like what's the significance? If it's your password, you still have to tell me, and then you have to like change it later. I I don't understand. Credit card name. Come on, Rico, don't leave me hanging. It's my IBAN. Send money, please. Don't send him any money. Don't send them any money. Send me money and I'll send it to him. All right, I promise. It's gonna actually, it, you know, Rico, if they send me the money first uh, and we send it to you in bulk later, which I promise to do, uh, you'll actually get, you'll actually make more money because they'll, you won't lose as much on like the fucking commissions, you know, that, the, the, that little, that little cut of the pie that all these companies take, you know, send, send me the money first chat. I'll, I promise Rico will get what's his, he'll get what's coming to him. I like the way you think. Am I in trouble or something that I haven't been following? <laughs> yeah, Rico, you are in trouble, man. That's the one thing I, I haven't told you yet, is that you are in trouble. Dude, can you imagine I just fucking actually like ban Rico? Like, I'm be Rico, I'm not gonna, you're not in trouble. <laughs> Rico, you're done. No, too many numbers in the name. Can't fucking read. You're ruining the chat. I just like. I just don't, I, I, whenever someone just has like an insane name, like this guy who's just going, <laughs> like their name's, <laughs> and you know who you are. Anyone seeing the chat right now can tell who I just read. Like, I don't fucking know how the hell that name's going to work. I'm not going to recognize that in a crowd. I mean, I will now because I read it out, but like, <laughs> like, oh, now I've ruined my monitor. I just like spat everywhere. <laughs> that sucked. Is that why you made that name? It was a, it was a trick. Oh, my desk is disgusting. Social hack. Say it, don't spray it. Dude, man, that's. Yell that to anyone, and they're gonna get fucking. That's a hack. Yeah, say it, don't spray it. Might be one of the most powerful statements you can say to anyone your whole life. Like, ever. I, if I'm in argument with someone in real life, <laughs> all I have to say is say it, don't spray it. And then when they get even angrier, say cool it, and just fucking back off. Like just leave right after. Just cool it. <laughs> Hang on. What do you call a cow in an earthquake? A milkshake. But bluff carrot is this like your fucking? Are you doing like a bit? Because this is just, I know for a fact you're also the one who did like the bear with no teeth being a gummy bear thing. And like, I mean, at this point, you might as well make your own stream, dude. I'll just send everyone over there. Because I guess you're fucking funny. You might as well make your own. Because like fucking hell, you are a goddamn riot. And yes, uh, in case you're confused, you are in trouble. You're in big trouble. <laughs> I'll just cover that every time now. Whenever I whenever I'm talking to someone, I'll make sure to detail if they are in fact in trouble. And you are. Cr 
criticized by tomato on humor, lol. Chat. Look, jokes like that, are those even, do, who, who are those jokes for? Like, who's fucking losing, who's actually honestly hands up losing their mind when someone tells a joke like that in real life? Those are like dad jokes. Me? Me. A lot of people saying me. Well, they're not for me. I guess I'm the only one. Guess I'm not invited to have fun. Like the rest of you. Grilled cheese. Daddy, thanks for the three gifted subs. Anyone who gifts a sub on this stream will in fact get a funny sound. I, actually, that one's not very funny. Uh... That's not even very funny. I take it back. You won't be getting anything. <laughs> Don't even bother gifting subs. I already canceled the event. It's over. I mean, I have one. I have... Ah! That one's so good. Queen Deity, thanks for the five gifted subs. Thank you very much, Queen Deity. Jamworth, thanks for the gifted sub. I mean, I'd love to say that, like, this is building towards something. Fallen Winter, thanks for the five gifted subs. Thank you very much, Fallen Winter, for that. Thank you very much for that. Kane Blackheart, thanks for the gifted sub as well. Chat, we are officially chat within fucking... Hang on. Hold up. One second. Wait. 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 Hang on. One more sec. Just give me one more second. Guys, we are officially within 2,100 subscriber points. Away from our next emote slot, dude. Let's get fucking hyped, bro. Dude. <laughs> I'm in like that cursed fucking upside down of like subscriptions on Twitch where it's just like, yeah, have a good luck getting another one. Fuck you. Where, like, basically the only way I get another emote slot is by either A, doing a subathon, which is never happening, ever, or B, doing it myself with my own money, which is probably what'll end up happening. Like, this is all very kind, MF, Goof, Sergeant Rorschach, all your gifted subs, Ubu with more gifted subs as always, thank you, Wolf Fells, another five gifted subs, thank you so much, Death Goof with ten. But like it's not it, it, it's not gonna get us anything it's not getting us anywhere basically for a new people are always like add a new emote and it's like yeah i'd love to um i'll have to kill one of the others any one of them will have to die and frankly if i had to bet what the next one to die is out of the emotes that exist garlic garlic and and dead Kill him. Kill him. I like the bean. The bean exists until the moment the devs of West of Loathing are like, you fucking can't do this. And I'll be like, you're right, I couldn't. But I had to try. It's like, it's sort of funny, chat, because it's like genuinely, if I wanted more emote slots, it would be easier to actually make an alternate channel, stream on it for two days, get partner again, and just like do crap over there. Like, I'd, I'd be like, yeah, people would have to fucking like subscribe to that one, but it'd be easier than fucking the, uh, the alternative, which is like fucking weird. I guess I could just do like fucking FFZ. FFZ is probably the game plan. Because then I, those ones are way easier. That's way easier to do, honestly. Like, because what? How many? How, what's the maximum amount of emotes you can have on a channel? Because I, I'm at the big boy threshold. I think I get two more ever. Two or three. I think I, I there's like, there's, I, I think I'll ever, ever, even if I had 10,000 subscribers, get like three more, maybe.
ever, ever. Seven TV is the new FFZ and it supports like 200. Well, I've never heard of that one. I've never heard of that one. I don't know what that is. Uretch, thanks for the five gifted subs, Uretch. Oh my God. The first five they've ever gifted to this channel. Uretch, you're the first, it's your first time experiencing the fucking, the, 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 the exact feeling of tossing your money into a fucking toilet and flushing it. Like, and then the toilet spits out a little thank you. And then that also gets flushed away before you even, you don't get any like physical reward. There's like nothing. It's the exact feeling of putting a five, like a $25, rolling it up, putting it in a toilet and just flushing it and like seeing where it goes. Thank you. I'm the toilet. You're three seconds of dopamine. <laughs> I appreciate the money. Comrade 135 grabs a fucking, grabs $50 and just hucks it in the toilet as well and starts stomping it down and flushes it as well. Thank you. Now I can use that money to invest. Yeah, I use it to invest now. I don't eat anymore. I don't sleep anymore. I just play the market. And by play the market, I mean, I just remembered that I have money invested in the markets and I should probably open up my app to see if um, I'm fucked today. Oh no, that's a lot of red today. I'm a uh, not good day, not good day today, huh? Which means it's time to buy. <laughs> Which means all this money is going straight into my buy fund. Yeah, 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 yeah. You buy the dip, so easy. So easy all the time. Buy, buy, buy. Now's the time to buy. Buy, 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 buy. Buy, buy low, sell lower. But, dude, I learned everything I learned from fucking the invisible hand, dude. Hey. El Quack Boculus Maximus. Thanks for the five gifted subs. God, your name was hard to read. Thanks for the five. Nautics. Thanks for the gifted sub as well. Comrade 135. 10 gifted subs. Thank you very much. My fate. Gifting us up as well. Tomato bits are down by now. I learned stocks from Gremlins 2. Wow, neato. <laughs> That's really cool, man. Dude, stop. Guys, honestly, you want to know it's like, you want to know the fastest way you can trick me into playing any video game ever? If you're like a dev and you want to get me, okay? Here's what you do to like get me into your, like get me to play your game, no matter what. Simulated market. Doesn't even need to be stocks, just needs to be like, I buy something here and it's worth more here. Okay, cool. You got me, you got me, you got me, you got me. I need to see numbers, I, need, I, I just need numbers. That's all I need, you got me. Make, them, make it so something is worth more one day than it is another day and you got me. I'm in. No Man's Sky? I think me and a bunch of the gang are playing No Man's Sky tonight, actually, after stream. Like, unironically. They were all like, I want to play it, and I was like, I liked it when I played it. We should see if it's good. Not on stream. That's going to be an off-stream thing for me, I think. Stream it. I, chat, I don't... Hydroneer? We are actually going back to Hydroneer soon. Because they had a bunch of updates for it. I'm probably playing Hydroneer again soon. I didn't really give it as much time as I wanted to. We're probably going back into the old dirt mine soon, digging for gold on the side of the river. WoW auction house stream. There's only one thing I wish I'd streamed ever in WoW, and it is the auction. It, it was walking into the auction house with like $12 and a bunch of copper and like just making enough money from my own sales to buy every other version of copper in the auction house and immediately flip it for 10 times what it's worth and ruining the market. The, the, I, I just leveled the whole game and as I was doing it, I ruined every ore at my level every time and I was getting fucking death threats over the mail system. It was dark. I was like actually just grabbing things and being like, oh yeah. 
copper ore. A stack of copper goes for like fucking five gold. More like 50. And then I just started doing that. And people, people had to go out and grind their own or they had to buy my ridiculously inflated horrible things. It was good. For like a, for a month, I was king of the auction. There was no one to stop me. There was no one to stop me. There was no one to yell at me. For a month. Well, chat, look, when you play an MMO, uh, it feels like you've been playing it for a thousand years when you've been playing it for about two minutes, at least as far as I'm concerned, okay? So yeah, it felt like about a year. I walked out of that place older, okay? Far older. Guys, I need to drink more caffeine. It's like, guys, I'm going to blow up. I actually will blow up soon. I'm going to blow up. Did you ever stream Caves of Cud? No, but I will soon. But before I do that, I need to uh, actually play through more of it and like get better at it because I'm not very good at it. But I am gonna, I am gonna play it soon, like, genuinely, with some mods. Cause I'm thinking I'm gonna play with the uh, version of the game. At least I don't know if it's like base game or if it's a mod that does it, but it lets you uh, play it as like more of an exploration game in that killing things doesn't give you XP. Um, exploring and discovering zones and like going into things does, which means that like it's the only like you are instead killing and exploring in the, the hopes that you'll get loot instead, which is I like that a lot more for that game because fighting things in that game is fucking cursed sometimes. So being like, oh, yes, I just discovered this place. So I got a bunch of XP. And like instead you get XP as well through um like doing the water ritual and stuff. So it's a lot more social the game after that which I like a lot more. It makes, it feels more like milestone gameplay instead of like kill a thousand fucking flower people in order to get your next level. And I don't like it when the returns are so diminished that like I am killing a thousand of something to get one XP. That shit's awful. You know? Are you still going to do the Sims idea you had? The extent of my Sims idea was play the Sims. So I'm not entirely sure if there's something I said that I don't remember. Because my idea for Sims was I'm going to play it on stream. It's genius. This guy's crazy. He really gets, guys, the thing about, <laughs> he really gets it. Oh my God. I'm going to have to like go into my bathroom before I start the game in like five minutes and like actually like cold water to my face. Like in a sh I'm going to put my face underneath the shower and like blast myself with water and I'm going to be like wet the rest of the stream instead. And it's happening. I'm going to finish. I've been sipping the five hour energy. I didn't drink it all at once. I've been sipping it because I was like, hey, second, now it's going to kick in. But instead, my body's like just rejecting the caffeine. Instead, it's just, it's just fucking not, it's not taking any of it. So I'm about, I'm going to have to do the dunk instead, I think. Oh, I just downed it. All right, I did. It made me wince. It made me wince. Now I don't feel so good. Have a cold shower on stream. Now, the most I can do is turn it on for about half a second and blast myself and then start the game and hope that uh, the high octane gameplay of watching. Guys, just remember as we go into this today. All right. If you decolon for any of these people, you're done. All right. Don't feel bad for them. They did something wrong to be here. Just don't forget that they did something wrong. I don't know what they did wrong. I have not played much of this game, nor do I know most of the controls, so this is going to be a little bit of help from you guys. There's not many ways to backseat a uh, sandbox game. So if I ask for something, you're free to answer, um, obviously. But um, they did something wrong. I can't tell you what, but they did. So I don't feel too bad. I'm going to go get cold water now and wake myself up or die trying. I'll be back in about a minute. And then we start playing the game. People's Playground.
I got it. I figured out what to do, chat. The, the water, it didn't do anything. I feel nothing. I feel sleepier than I did before. But what I did remember is I have a special light that simulates the sun. My, I'm going to plug it in. I'm going to turn it on. I'm going to turn it at my face. And um, I will fool my body into believing that I am actually outside in the sun with vitamin D. Is it called a window? Chat, the sun hasn't shined around where I live in about five to six weeks. All right. I'm going to find a way to plug this thing and I might die because it's a real fucking mess out there. And I think the mouse. Oh, I forgot about the mouse. I think the mouse might be around here too. I don't know. I saw it by the entrance of my room. Uh, I'm going to go for this though. Oh, Jesus. All right. Oh my God. That is really bright. Actually. Oh, this is going to do this. is. I'm already feeling it. It's probably just fucking. See, Jack, here's the problem is that you're not really supposed to look into these lights. And, like, it's directly behind my monitor, so instead my eyes are just cooking now. But it's gonna wait. I feel more awake. I actually do, like, already. But that's because I'm staring into a light. Uh, it, it, it's... Well, look, chat, okay? I worked in... I didn't work, but I did a lot of theater when I was younger. And whenever you're on a stage and they needed stage lights on... You're staring into the sun for two hours of that show if you're on stage. Okay, I, I'm used to that. <laughs> Community theater crap. They, anyone, any light is on and it's going straight into your eyes for some reason. They, there's no way to design them differently. Theater kid. Dude, I, I, it was like a, it was like a camp sort of. It was like really cool in uh near where I lived, you would go there and you'd be given a script for a play over the summer. And obviously like the people that work there are helping and organizing it, but you learn your role and do everything in one week and perform over the weekend for like the parents and stuff. It was really cool, dude. It was actually like really fun. Like it taught me a lot about like being funny and spontaneous and shit. It was actually really fucking cool. Yep, circus camp. Shut up, dude. <laughs> it wasn't circus camp, but you do like auditions and then like they would put kids into the can act and can't act club because anyone could sign up, but there were kids that just couldn't act. So they gave them like side roles. Dude, I, I was always given, I was never given like the main role. I was given the look at me, I'm doing my own thing and like a side act for the entire goddamn thing. I was basically the clown. You're right, fuck. Like, I would never be the main character or like the, like one of the side characters. No, I was, I was, a, I was a side character. You know, I wasn't one of like, I wasn't the deuteragonist or whatever the fuck it is or the tritagonist. I was guy who does an uninterrupted fucking seven minutes of like method acting in the woods while people throw things at him from offstage. You know, that was me. I was the, I was the clown, I guess, huh? But it was funny, dude. That for a while, I mean, everyone for a while is like, I want to be a fucking actor. But like, I was like, people like la laughing at me. I'm going to be a clown. <laughs> no, I never wanted to be a clown. But I was like, I was like, dude, I hold so much power over these people right now. I hold so much power over them. I'm po it's powerful. It's fun. Now you're here. Yeah. Yeah. Now I'm here. Washed up. E clown. It's not the same. Dude, I gotta clean out my fucking room. I throw a bottle now to the corner where my bottles usually go when I don't have time to clear them out. And now the bottle just bounces off of the pile of bottles that has reached far too high. And then crosses the room to the other side into a now alternative bottle pile. It's pretty, and it's so easy to clean them out and I just don't do it. Get a trash can. 
Chat, bottles are big and I got, what, let me count here how many bottles are next to me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. There's at least sixty bottles here. <laughs> I, Chad, I just haven't had time to take them out. I'm so busy making quality content for all of you. It's water. Like it's not like this isn't I'm I gotta hydrate. Chat, this uh this fucking light is making me actually sweat. I think I'm cooking. But it woke me up. I'm, I woke up, chat. This light did it. I'm gonna use this thing all the time from now on. This light did it. But I'm sweat, I am actually dripping. It got me, this is, I gotta hang on. Oh my God, this thing's like on fire. I just touched the, uh, the, the I just touched it. Uh, this thing's a heater. I need to. I'm turning on AC, Chen. That's it. Maybe this is just the, maybe my body's just feeling awake now because it's the first time in about five years I've gotten like vitamin D. Or like a vitamin D fucking um, adjacent concept. I've had this thing my whole life. Well, not my whole life, but it lasts like two, three years. And like, I just, any vitamin at all. I take goddamn I take vitamins, okay? I'm a growing boy. I take care of myself. I've actually been taking better care of myself now than I have in like fucking 10 years. Chat. I work out a good amount. I work out sometimes I miss a day or two because I, I get distracted, but I work out almost every night. I take my vitamins. I I like I I do everything. I pray to Jesus? Oh yeah, you guys know I'm praying. I mean, come on, you don't need to ask me that. I pray, of course I'm praying to big JC. Making sure me and him are good. Every time, working out before bed. Some people do that. I like working out, I like working out like uh, an hour before I go to sleep. Cause I take a shower, and I take it easy and go to sleep like, uh, like an hour later. Piece of cake. Working out and praying in God's country. Yeah, I mean, we can all agree that East, the East Coast is the closest thing we're getting to God's country. The rest of you can go to hell. All right, I'm in God's country and it's a shithole. All right, but it is God's country. All right, I'm in God's country. I look out there in the rolling hills and I see a cow taking a fucking heaving dump. And then flopping over into it to like hang out. And I'm like, that's goddamn God's country right there. What a great day. What a great day. Every day is a great day here in God's country. All right. Now that I've woken up, now that I, now that I, now that the light has burned into my corneas enough for me to function. How about we go in there and hang out with the people? The people, chat, the people. You know, them, the them. Oh my God, I actually can't look at my other monitor because there's a fucking light in the way. Uh, I can't see the screen to click on play the game. Hang on, I need to like move this. I actually can't see half of my computer. Uh. People, playground. Remember, D colon is outlawed, and if I catch anyone using it, um, <laughs> let's just say my mods are taking names down. Let's just say that we are, we are capturing evidence. All right. Okay. Let's just say that we are capturing evidence so if you don't know what People Playground is, it's a game for psychos uh, so they can get out of their system so they don't uh, use actual people as a uh, murder playground. Um, uh, it's made for a special kind of person. That person is, I guess, sort of me. I find these games somewhat 
uh, interesting in an insane sort of way. But like, if someone walked in and saw me playing this game, I'd I think I'd rather have like you know porn up at a certain point. Like, because this one's real bad. You can, like, rip someone in half and they just scream. It's, like, real fucked up. I think I'd rather have them catch me than anything else because be, it's easier to, like, you know. That, at least this doesn't... At least that wouldn't make me look like a psycho. <laughs> dude, I remember... Dude, I remember when I was younger. I fucking remember... Goddamn... One Piece... Four Kids... The four kids one. Dude, even that one, my parents saw some of those characters in that and they were like, yo, what the hell you watching, my guy? What the hell you watching, son? And I'm like, God. <laughs> I don't know, I don't care about that. I just like seeing the, the punching happen. They're like, what the hell is this, son? What are you watching? Come on, guys, it's not a big deal. I didn't even notice what they were concerned about. I just like watching the, the rubber guy do the funny punch is all. All right, so I got some mods on this thing. I just downloaded whatever said it was the most popular because I trust the community, and that probably means we have some memes and cocks in this, which is fine. Uh, you know, let me do an audio check to make sure that we can actually hear the game. I fucking can't. Oh, wait, no, there's wind. Okay, there's wind. I can't hear it. Right? I can't hear it. We can hear it. Okay, I can hear the ding, so we can hear it. Uh, all right. Let's play. I have to move the light. I, I, I moved it a little bit, and it wasn't enough. I'm turning it around. Okay, I'll turn it back around if I'm falling, if I'm, like, falling asleep again. Alright, so we got some choices here for a map. As a uh, full disclosure, I did um, steal this content. This is a stolen stream. I stole it. I walked into Charborg's stream. And I said, this is mine now. And I took the game. So uh, I'm, I'm going to be honest. I'm going to come out and uh, fucking admit to it here. Because I know at some point Charborg's going to see this. And all I have to say to that is you can't stop me. You can't stop me. That's all. Uh, anyways, we can play, uh, a couple of maps here. Why don't we just go into, like, the default one? Then we can go into... The Abyss. That one, I don't think I like the vibe of that one. Uh, yeah, you wanna just take a, you wanna just take a look at it? Let's take a look at the abyss. All right, whatever. I, I I genuinely don't know any of the buttons for this game. Like, I know how to spawn something in. Uh. The hell? Hello? Oh my. God. <laughs> All right, so that's the abyss. Uh, it's the pit. It's a pit. So we got a, we can spawn in um, a guy with a brain or just a normal human, very fragile. Let's just spawn in a normal guy. So this game's like a sandbox game for maniacs where you can like take a guy, pick him up and break his entire body. And then we'll just take it. Well, that one, that one was like an example one. We'll just throw that guy. We'll just grab that guy and uh, put him in the, oh no. All right, so that guy's gone. Don't be, hey, all right. Hey, what did I say, chap? What did I fucking say? That guy fell apart when I tried to throw him. All right, so let me let me try to get used to the controls here. So this guy's got all these joints. He's got this like he's got like an arm. He's got legs. Can I like tell it to stop moving? Yes. Uh. Okay, I don't really want to hurt him. Straighten back up. Unfreeze his hand. Everything's fine. Drag and select. Oh. Make this guy small. Guy? I don't think the shrink... Uh is good for him. I'm gonna upscale him again. Back to normal. 
sir? He his body is holding a shape. He's he's coming back together. Sir? Uh Okay, we're gonna We're gonna take we're gonna put the this one's um this guy here Oh Jesus Christ. Uh hang on, I need something I can use to sweep all this into the some of it's going in there. Wait, I don't want to resize this guy anymore. I'm done with it. Um stop it. Stop resizing, I'm done with him. We're just gonna put this in the we're gonna go ahead and just we'll make one of these for a second. Hang on. Uh, and we're just gonna use this as sort of like a broom <laughs> to sort of move these parts into the abyss. And that'll be a problem for someone else. How do I put a man on a bike? That's like, I think stuff like this is like the first thing to do. We'll use big guy brain, like the guy with the brain. I want to put this guy on the bike. Sir. He's, he hates this. Get on the, get on the bike. There you go. There you go. Get that ass on the bike. Like, so. So I don't think this is, I don't think I, Chad, what's the key binding to make him get on the bike? Cause I think I just blew up his scrope with that one. Uh, I broke his bum. Uh, what, how do I, F, F. Okay, F. You're driving the bike now. Okay, so that's a problem for the people down there again. Uh, let's put in another guy. Alright. So that didn't really... I sort of want... It didn't really, uh, didn't really do what I wanted. You know what I mean? I want, I want this guy, I want to know, I need to learn how to control a man. You know what I mean? So take the bike. No, no, no let's do, let's do a car. There you go. Oops. Uh, okay, we're going to throw those ones in the pit. Uh, I'm going to try it again. Okay, we're going to try a car. Okay, so the, the door opens like that. Press Q and it spawns facing the other way. Okay, that's good. Uh, how... Get in it. I need to get this guy in it. Get in the car. I want to put him in the car. You can't put people inside the... I can't put people inside this car. You're telling me I can't put a guy in this car. You're telling me this guy's gonna just flail around and I can't put him in the car. What good is him? Well, I mean, what good's the car? We'll get rid of that. We'll add another guy. Let's just, like, play around in the space, chat. We got all these things to play with. You can wire it to him. I don't want to wire this guy. All right, all right, all right. How do I give this guy this big gun? Take the gun. He's scared of it. Oh! He's still alive. This guy's not done yet. He got shot, but he's not dead. But he's, str he's struggling to stand. He's pointing at something. Hang on, isn't it like medicine? Uh, gorse. What's gorse? I don't know what gorse is. Hang on, sir, don't worry. I got gorse. Okay. Uh. Gorse blood. Not recommended to inject. Um, I did. I injected. Right, we're gonna. We're gonna need someone new. This guy's not working. Oh Jesus Christ! What the fuck is happening? I right, don't inject gorse blood to people. Oh my God! Oh! Everyone disregard the what's. Uh, we're just gonna sweep this guy into the pit. That'll be someone else's problem after today. Yeah. And we'll toss the evidence into. If you press F on their hand while the gun's close, they'll hold it. All right, that's what I want to do. I want to arm this one with the brain. 
with uh this like silly gun yeah uh, you know what? let's arm him with a fucking fire extinguisher okay hey hey where are you he's gonna regret going this way i'll tell you that right now because over here okay over here is a guy is fucking minecraft Yeah, not so tough anymore, huh? Yeah, that's right, fucker. Minecraft's over here. And he's got a gun this time. Pick this up, Steve. There you fucking go. All right, Steve. <laughs> kill him. Steve, now kill him. Hang on. Hell, hold up. I got to guide him more than that. Okay. I think what I need to do is, like, set it to hold. You can pause with space. Okay. Okay. How do I, like, rotate this thing, though? I want to, like, turn it. I, I want this thing to rotate. Oh, there we go. There we go. Alright. Oh, what have I done? Okay. So, I kind of ruined Steve, and now everyone's got health bars on their body, and I don't know how I did that. S. Okay. Uh. Steve is trying to get up. You wait here, man. I'm getting rid of this guy. <laughs> you just wait right there. I'm gonna sweep this guy into the pit. Gone before his time. Really fucking sad what happened to Steve. But, uh, we're gonna get him in the hole. What am I gonna do with you? What do I got? We got bombs. We got an EMP generator. All right, that was worthless. Huck that in the pit. Uh, we got a fucking sad face barrel. He's alive. He's on fire. Oh wait, I have, we have something for this. We, have, we I can save him. I can save him. I can save him. I can save him. Man, are you okay? He's not dead. Let me see if I can find something. Coagulation serum. This will heal all bleeding wounds. Not really bleeding. I need a uh, serum that will life syringe. Heals living beings instantly. Don't worry, man. Man, man, I got the life serum right here, man. Yeah, feeling better already. That's not the right syringe. Okay, what I made was what looks to be the death syringe. Oh, no. Man, you're alive. I saved your life. I sent him into an upside down realm between life and death where he constantly dies and it's come he comes back to life instantly. And now and now I'm going to give him the zombie syringe which will also turn him into a zombie which will probably in the end at the end of the day just turn him into like a superhero at this point. Yeah, man. How you feeling? How you feeling? Now let's coagulate his blood. Stop. Hey, stop it. All right, his blood has been officially coagulated. He won't be bleeding anymore. Is this coagulating his body too, though? <laughs> He's trying to take it out of him. Uh, man. He's like seizing up. I mean, hang on, I'm trying to get it out of him. Don't worry, man, you're fine. Are you feeling all right? He's fine, he's fine. Which is good, because I'm about to fucking see if he still bleeds. It's good, because I need to now check if he's going... To aim, you can rotate something... While holding it. I... No, but I barely know the rotate... Okay, okay, I got it. 
A and D. All right, let's see if this guy still bleeds. Don't we have melee weapons? Do we have a knife somewhere? I need a, uh, oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. I'm just gonna grab a, the worm staff. So I see what this, it's okay, the worms won't be able to find anything to use because you can't bleed. Yeah? Yeah? Okay, I don't like the worm stat, that's sort of a curse. Will he bleed? No! Look at that, he's fucking fine! Look at that! Oh, he's bleeding! Wait, no he isn't! Man, this guy's having a rough one. I'm gonna send him into the... I'm just gonna put him in the... The pit. That's someone else's problem. Let's make, uh, let's just make something. What the hell is this thing? That's a fucking Markiplier meme, huh? That's going right in the pit. No chance. That one's going right in the pit. All right, he's in the pit. All right, here we have, this is a gorse. This is, uh, this is one of the things that we were seeing before. This is a gorse, of course. Even we don't want- Dude, dude, I love tubers in my fucking games, bro! I mean, this is a mod. That was a mod that added that. I don't know which one. Will the gorse react if I just fucking... Oh my god, I keep pressing E by accident. Is this gonna... Alright, the gorse hates that. That's fine, I don't like him. Huck him in the pit. Ooh, look at that fucking rim. Look at the rim there. Look at that. Perfect. No, I actually sort of want to see how far this thing goes. Let's watch. Okay, it's still going. That's a deep fucking pit. Wow. That's, uh... Hello? I'm hearing, like, spooky sounds. Uh, well, look, we're gonna make, uh... I'm, look, Shabby, just got... What's that? Gorsian armor? I don't want that. I'm gonna make a demon. Wow, that demon's pretty tall. I'm gonna use that demon to... I gave the demon armor, and I hucked him in the pit. So I, what I'm gonna do now is just sort of... Aim my gun down there. And clean that up. I don't want that guy alive down there. So that'll <laughs> that'll get rid of him. I'm making a criminal. This is a tall guy, or, or is he? Hang on. Is this a tall guy or is this a normal sized guy? Okay, that's a normal sized guy. But I want him facing in the other direction. So I'm hawking that guy in the pit. Uh, I want him facing this way, because I want to see if this guy has any evil in his heart. Because this one's supposed to have a brain. So I'm gonna hand him scissors. Okay. Pick this up. Yeah! Now kill that guy. How- I want this guy... to kill this guy. Get... this guy. Control human. I'm trying. I don't know how I flipped over right there. I like started turning the other way and now I don't know how to fix it again. Alright, 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 alright. This isn't working. This isn't working. Stop controlling this guy. Stop controlling. Alright, that's not gonna happen. Uh, I'm gonna give you... Look, I'll just give you this the scythe of death. That's an axe. That'll probably do better than what I was using before. Oh, Jesus! His hands! Uh, we have a syringe for this. We can fix him. Uh, I'm gonna... I'm gonna syringe him with... I don't know... Amputation thing. We have to take his hands. I mean, the needle does what it says, which is... Makes it easy to... Alright, that's a bad... Who made that? 
Why would someone make that? This criminal's just been sitting here. Alright, we're gonna just get rid of these ones again. Get off of it! Alright, get... Get these guys off of this thing and huck them in the hole. Uh, let's figure out what we want to do here. What do I... I just want to experiment... Blood tank. Wait, what the hell's all this? Dude, there's a whole progression system to this game, dude! I want this thing to stay. I want to rotate this thing. I want it to stay right here. I want to. I want this thing to stay here forever. How do I do that? Drag and rotate objects. No, I want to. I want you to stay right here. There we go. Freeze. Guess that would work too. I just. I just tied it down. See, it's not. It's not going anywhere now. See that? Yeah. That's more. That's more realistic, chat. I want to see what this will do to a human, a human body. We'll use a, uh, we'll use a criminal. Oh, it's pretty small. Gotta yeah, get closer to it, man. I need to see what it does to a human. Whoa. Okay, we're gonna grab this and huck that in the pit. Now hook a battery up to it. I don't think I even need it. A fusion bomb. Easily the most powerful bomb available. I think we want to start smaller than that. Like uh, this bomb. Let's, uh, let's just get like, uh, I don't know. Uh, this guy. Who's this? Transparent here. We'll get fucking... We'll get this thing. Uh, this guy. No, we'll get... We'll get why... Why Putin? I have no idea where these mods are coming from. Alright. I don't know where some of these are coming from. Strapping batteries to stuff makes them super lasers. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna grab, uh, SCP-096 then. That's pretty fun. Let's see if I if I strap a battery. We'll strap a battery to the thing. Laser pointer. Okay, so right now this thing's just a normal laser pointer. That's pretty cool. Where's the battery? Slider, ion thruster. Winches, thermometers, Tesla coils. I don't see. I guess I could search it. Really? This fucking tiny thing is gonna be. Oh my god. Right, we're gonna throw that guy. You know, right in the hole. And uh, we're gonna get rid of this. How do I get rid of, get rid of that, get rid of that. I want a battery here though, cause I wanna see what else I can do with this thing. Is this SCP Foundation? Oh yeah, so it is. Uh. I don't know, none of these mean anything to me. Now try generator. Okay, uh, hang on. Before I do that, I want to try electromagnet. How does this thing work? Wow, Dido. <laughs> wow, it's a magnet. I knew that would happen. All right, let, hang on, hang on. It's just so much stuff. It's like such an elaborate sandbox. It's like I'm barely scratching the surface. That's because I need to like spend time figuring out what all these different things mean and do. Like, how do I know what's gonna happen if I make this guy here and then I put another one of them right there and then I give one of them like a fucking gun? Cause the other one, they got brains. They should be able to connect the dots. Hang on. And freeze the game. You, I can't, hang on, I gotta like, 
I... And stay there while I put, while I make you pick it up. Now unfreed. Now you go berserk. He's trying to grab, I think this guy's trying to grab something. He's trying to grab something to defend himself, but the guns ain't, hang on, let me help him. Okay, he, don't, he seems to not care. Okay, this guy's supposed to have a brain, so he's not gonna just... Oh, what needle was that that he just stuck himself with? I don't know, he's going... Okay, this guy ended up really blowing it. I have no idea what he's doing. Stop. 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 I don't understand. The brain one... The... Oh, God. He got the zombie virus in him. He got pricked with zombie virus, right? Which one? Which needle was that? Which needle is this? I don't even remember which one this is. How do I check? Dark green. Alright, we'll just check through this. No, that should be life syringe, dude. That's a life syringe. That one, though, is zombie virus. Uh, okay, so he's got a little bit of both in him, but it's fine because he's going right into the pit, I think. Yikes. Yeah, that guy's gone. Dude, stop. It doesn't even matter anymore. Just stop. All right. I fixed him. I need to get rid of this. This guy actually has to go. I gotta get rid of this guy. We're getting rid of him. Wow, he is very small. Hang on. Dude, get the fuck out of here. He's like a fucking amoeba. Get, I'm hucking him in the pit. I think I had a hold on him right there. We're gonna clean the slate clean. And also just send that down there, I think. Yeah, it's going down there. All right, so like, what's like some of the crazy stuff you can do in this game, right? I need, I need something crazy to do. What's like the crazy stuff? I'm gonna make some people. I'm gonna make a collection of people. Okay, I made too many people. I'm gonna get rid of some of these people. You still alive, man? 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 Okay, I'm gonna make a couple people. Again. Like a collection of like five to six people. And then, all right, next time. All right, next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna, we're gonna tape them together. We're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna tape all these people together. We're taping them all together. I'm taping them. Yes. With rigid, with rigid wiring. Yes. Yes. I'm gonna tape them together. With what I believe is metal. Wait, what's a heat pipe? I'm scared to know what that does. I don't wanna know. Yes, now if I move one of them they must all move together or die. They will learn to work together as a team or they will perish. And now, and now, wait, so are the, is this like a magnetic thing? Hang on. No, this is not metal, which is good. Or is it, and I just need to boost its power? No. Okay, we're getting rid of this. That's going somewhere else. 
make one of them go berserk. I'm gonna make this guy go berserk. This guy seems like he'd go berserk. Wait, ignore breathing. What the hell does that mean? Man? That guy's dead. Did you download any blueprints? No, but I probably should. I don't know, I got like a... Does anyone want like a Markiplier mustache? That's fucking cool. Wait, what's this duck? I'm turning the game down. Uh, it disappeared when I pressed F on it. Wait, whoa, 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 I just saw it again. Generator plus a laser pointer. All right, hang on, hang on, hang on, the generator. Industrial generator. All right. Turn that bad boy on to maximum power. And freeze it right there. And now we grab ourselves a flashlight. Whoa! Okay, that blew it up. Oh, Jesus! Oh my, okay, we need something more powerful. I'm gonna try to plug this light bulb into the industrial generator. In jaw-dropping, HD, slow motion. Let's get that again once more. Hang on, I'm moving. I'm going to move this generator closer to these guys so I can fuck with them easier. You need to wire them. Shut up, chat! I'm seeing this thing work even without wiring. I don't want to wire it yet. Can you please stay here? Okay, that thing, this thing might just be too strong. Use a wire D colon. Keep fucking with me, I'm gonna turn on this thing. And then I'm gonna touch it to the generator. Do you want that? You want me to make a loud sound? Okay, that actually doesn't do much of a difference. I'm gonna have to shut that thing up. Stop. Stop it. Stop it forever. Why didn't you turn off? How was I supposed to know it would like continue to make sounds? All right, I, I know what I'm gonna do. All right, we're gonna grab it. We're gonna test it with the laser pointer. Everyone was like, use the laser pointer once. I'm gonna use the laser pointer. In jaw dropping HD. Oh! His oh! Oh, Jesus! His legs are all like fucking blown up and shit. Okay, so that was cool. Now, uh, I'm going to now get a uh, a, a, a thruster, an ion thruster. I might turn this thing around. I might turn this on. This is probably a big mistake. I don't even think that really hurt them. No, a couple people got burns. <laughs> Wrong way. It generates no heat. Oh, yeah? Well, this fucking thing would have looked like I winced when they saw it. Yeah, this fucking thing right here is gonna generate some heat, all right? Yeah, this thing right here is gonna generate a lot of heat, not gonna generate heat. I'm actually making a wire for this one. Where's the wire tool? Is it this thing? I, I, which one? Oh, here we go, wire. Ow. 
I also need to tie this thing. I'm, I know it's frozen. I'm gonna tie it down as well. Just in case. Just in case. Oh! Hello? <laughs> oh my god! Is there anyone alive? Is anyone alive? Wire up a second generator. There's no way that's gonna happen. I mean, would it even matter? No, no, no. They can't. It can't care if there's more. So, like, what if I, like, grab a guy now? You know? Like, this is a ghost. This is a haunted ectoplasm being. Hang on. I have to, like, turn this down. This is... Oh, my God. This thing was so strong, it emptied the pit. The force of that threw things out of the pit and back onto the surface. I'm gonna make a ghost. What the hell is that? Is that a bomb? No, it's a needle. Yeah, that thing evaporated. Okay, ghost Chan. Come on. Okay, that was accidental. That wire's not supposed to be there. Sorry about that. All right, Ghost Chan, I just want to find out for sure if, like, a ghost can be melted by high-power engines. Let's see it in stunning HD. Well, you heard it here first, chat. Apparently, look, if you need to get rid of a ghost, call, like, NASA or something and just ask if you can borrow, like, one of their fucking engines. Because I don't think a ghost can survive that. Its soul is gone. I gotta turn this thing that hell off. And get rid of it. That was fucking... That was wacky. That was wacky. Okay. So, uh, first thing I'm gonna do, though, is, um, actually sweep the floors. All you are supposed to be down there. All this should be gone. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna do this really quick. Get this all back in the hole. Go on now, back where you belong. Back where you belong, get the hell in there. What's, uh, what's going on with this thing? Use the clear everything button to delete all the stuff. No, I, want, I don't want to do that. I want there to be stuff so we can see all the horrible things I've done. What's the fun in clearing everything? What the hell? Aerial Faith Plate. Alright. That's pretty cool. Hang on, how far is that gonna huck someone? If I, uh... You know. Neato. Uh, hang on. Freeze this thing to the ground. Stop right there. Perfect, perfect. Now, uh, connect it to an electrical wire into two separate generators. Okay, so that broke the thing. Like, it, it moved too fast and it broke it. I can't, like, free it. Is it heating up the thing? Uh... Okay, it broke it eventually. That's fine, I need a new one. I, I need a new thing. That one, that one's not gonna... That, we get one use on that. So let me freeze up the game. Hang on, I'm gonna do, we're gonna do this properly. I wanna see what happens. We're gonna do this in stunning... In stunning HD. Again. A second time in stunning HD. Oh, fucking Christ. Let me get this guy on the panel. Alright, get him right on the fucking blue part. Right there. Okay. Now we're gonna go ahead and tape these things down. 
let it charge up, and then turn it onto slow motion. And press F. That was in 20% speed, and his body fucking exploded like a firework from the speed. Like, he, he just disintegrated. Where are the parts? Oh my god! Holy shit! Well, he's gone. How fast, uh, could I, like, use this as a means to dispose of guys? Okay, I gotta tape that down first. All right, that can't just be done like that. That's gotta be done, that's gotta be done with the... The top generator isn't on. Stop adding me. It doesn't matter. The friggin' normal generator is exploding, people. It doesn't matter. Chat, please. I'm having fun. I figure stuff out on my own. You need to at me like five times for it. Like I have people like adding me. It does to me. It doesn't matter. Chat, whenever anything touches this thing, it instantly explodes. How's this? Immobility field. Hang on. I want to see this. Hold up here. How's this thing work? Does it make it like larger if this thing's on? Okay. So if something goes in it, does it stop moving? Okay, we're gonna just toss that guy in the hole. Sweep all that in the hole. Okay, so the immobility field like a like a like a opposite magnet just sort of hucked itself away when it touched it. That's fine. Decimator. Okay, so this thing can decimate anything in its air. Oh, fucking Jesus. Oh, Jesus Christ! What do I do? 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 What do I do about this one? What do I do? What do I do? I'm gonna feed it blood. This thing might like blood. How's it, uh, hang on, might as well, uh, grab a flashlight and, uh, take a look. Maybe stuff's- honestly, I don't think- I just don't think we can go downstairs anymore. So, like, maybe I just... You know... Go into the pit? See how stuff's going down there? We don't go to the surface world anymore. No one goes into the surface anymore. That's where the black hole is. And one day, it's gonna come for us all. We don't go up top anymore. Oh, it's gone. All right. I am gonna wipe the, uh, I'm gonna clear everything now. Get some frames back. All right, so that's gone. Hang on, I didn't even get to see it decimate. I wasn't even able to see a decimation. All right, I'm gonna send, I'm gonna put this guy in there to be decimated. I'm putting a man inside the thing. Oh. Oh, so it's like a fucking a disposal bin. Nice. Large decimator. Wide. <laughs> oh, Jesus! Why is that so loud now? Is it because it's wide? <laughs> Ow! <laughs> I turned it down. Not any quieter. And now it's quiet. Why is it? Oh, Jesus, that was fucked up. 
That guy got like cut in half and immediately disintegrated. Wait a minute. Hang on. What happens if I... <laughs> okay. Oh god, this is the perfect chance to test. Okay, one just immediately deactivates the other. That one beat that one to it, so it's the winner. Okay, okay. Yeah, nothing wrong there. Okay, I can turn off my AC again now. Yo, chat, this light, this light I have that I never used actually fucking saved the whole stream. Just be like thanking it. How strong is this thing if not for like a, if like, if there's no bullshit? How, how, uh, how big does this thing go? Oh, not a problem. And with the battery? last for like a second okay get rid of it thanks light thank the light it's the only reason i'm here right now wait a defibrillator chat we can bring people back to life okay uh stop following it freeze it here i'm gonna we're gonna do some doctoring i want to see what i can do with a man okay with a living man so i'm gonna go grab some more needles uh not gonna inject gorse blood like the knockout syringe, but knocks them out until given an antidote. I don't really want that. Painkiller. Never feel pain again. Okay, so, so here's what I'm going to do. I am going to inject you with a painkiller syringe. First, of course, naturally. So you no longer feel any pain. Now, I'm going to inject you with a syringe that will turn you into a ghost. So that you can fall through the ground into the core of the earth. But apparently, I'm not your leg. Hang on, I'm gonna grab. Hang on, I got that. I, I can handle that. That might be the scariest fucking thing ever in this world. Like just like fucking falling forever as a ghost into the void. He's gone. He's gone. He's not coming back. That guy's gone. Right, I'm gonna put a cat, a hazmat suit on you. Get this crap on you. I need you to be safe. Cause I'm about to, I'm about to do some real dark shit to you, man. I need you to be. Is he dead? Oh my god. What do I... Oh! Alright, so his bones were not broken. Why did it say fix or break? Fix him! Mend! Alright, he's been mended. Just put this the fuck on ya. Alright, we'll fucking heal him once. He... Alright, there. Now I'll just like do the, I'll just use a life syringe. It's whatever. Like it's right, it's like right around here. Hello, death syringe, life syringe. This one's made for living. Welcome back. You're alive because of me, because of my hard work. All right, so it's time for us to see what exactly we can do here. All right, all right. So, Ultra Strength Syringe might cause immortality. Oh no. Well, sir, unfortunately for you, we've decided to turn you into a cruel, cruel test subject more than anything. I'm gonna fucking need to, like, rope you down now. Can't have you wiggling too much. Cause we need to see, we need to see what some of these things do. First of all, I'm gonna inject you with exotic liquid. 
It says no one knows. It says people don't know what this does. Uh, what the hell is it? What the hell is that? Sir, remain calm. Before I inject you with that, I will, of course, be injecting you with the ultra strength syringe, so you're essentially immortal. Please fucking hold still enough that I can actually do it. I think it counted. Or he'd be dead. Not seeing any of the syringe go in. Stop fucking- alright! I'm gonna need you to stay right there, son. Sir? Get rid of the helmet, you don't need that. I'm gonna- I- There it is, num num. Num num. Where's the life syringe? Alright, that's the ghost syringe. Fuck. Alright, is there any part of it that's still real? I need something that I can use to inject this guy. Or right, his... Fuck, I just deleted his leg. Oh! That's dark. That's really dark. That is actually extremely fucking dark. <laughs> We're gonna need another man. Get that costume on, asshole! Man? I'm gonna bring him back to life so I can see his reaction. Okay, man. I'm injecting you with some crazy shit. Please don't fucking squirm. All right, this guy should be a god now. He should be basically unkillable. So I'm gonna rope him down. Okay. With struts, because I don't want him, I don't want him to move. So we're gonna hold him down with struts. He should have a god thing in him. So I'm going to test it. We're gonna just give it a quick test. Uh, and to do that, I'm going to use a detached laser cannon. Uh, which of course should be plenty powerful to test his action. If he's actually a god, uh, this is going to tell us. So we're going to use the detached laser cannon. Do this on slow speed. The fucking thing said he'd be fine. The needle said he would be fine. Where is the life syringe? I'm not done with you yet. Oh my god, he's like burning. Hang on. Arise! Where's his head? <laughs> Fuck. Uh, where's his head? Where's his head? Where's his head? Where's his head? It's probably in the pit. Hang on, chat. The head probably fell down here into the pit. Hello? Okay, there's nothing down there. Okay, how do I replace a head? I need a new one. Wait, of course! Hang on, Chad, we'll just get a new head. It's easy. Make a guy, okay. And I'm going to make him stay right here. I need... I only need some of them. I need to... I need him... I need most of him dead. Stay right there, sir. We're gonna have to cut a little bit off, but it's gonna be fine. Do we have, like, a laser sword? Energy sword. This'll do. So we just do a clean cut. Oh my god. This is, like, the kind of game that, like... Get streamers like outed as insane maniacs. Like, I, I mean, I was talking about this. Now I can heal him. This is the life syringe. Yep. Now we'll use a mending syringe. Then a life one again. 
right as rain. And now we're going to unfreeze him. And we're gonna pause the game and get ready to connect these bodies. Oh, what have I done? Okay. Hang on, we have to do this like sorta of, we have to do this sort of it's like weird. I have to first I need to fucking freeze this guy right here. Good. Stop right there. Freeze. How do I connect these two together? With common science at my disposal. <laughs> oh my god. First of all, I'm gonna need a heart monitor so I can tell if he's even alive in there. So let me connect a wire. What do we got, doctor? This isn't the right wire or this guy's dead. It says that we need to connect the wire. Blood wire, fuck. Where's that blood wire? Blood wrestle wire. Wait. Arise. Arise. <laughs> Don't you fucking die on me. <laughs> Don't you fucking die on me, son! Myth! Where's that fucking defibrillator? Where's the defibrillator? You're gonna live whether you like it or not! I'm gonna bring you back! Man, man, you can't die on me, man. You can't die on me. I need, I need you. Man, man. I need to move the city outside. Man, man, man. Clear. I need, I need both of them, huh? Clear. I need to apply both of them, huh? That's hard. How do I like, Chaz, there a key binding to freeze things? I don't want to have to like right click to do it. That's my problem right now. I need a key binding to do it. Try F. I literally already use F to start things. Answer my actual question. I don't care about the defibrillator. I need to know how to freeze things. No key bind. I want to know how to pause and run. I know that, but oh, you guys don't get it. Hang on. I'm going to look in the options because you guys, I guess, don't understand what I'm asking. I want to know if there's a way I can, like, freeze a character with a button instead of having to right click and then click on it. No. That's annoying. To be fair, that's a very complicated question. Asking if the key binding exists. <laughs> it's not a very complicated question. <laughs> it's fine. It's, I don't think anyone, I think people just got confused. So is this guy able to live on his own? No, he's living. Drop it! Hey! Give that back. That's not yours. Don't fucking take it. He doesn't want to live anymore. I gotta do this. Son of a bitch! Don't die on me! Clear! Okay, I gotta read what the thing does. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's just check it. Defibrillator, defibrillator, defibrillator. Where the hell is it? Hold one of the pads on the upper chest and activate. The heart will be restarted. This can be used to revive people during a short period after their death. It does not heal wounds. And you move this closer to the chest. <laughs> Clear! 
I'm I don't know if I can lie them down. I don't know how close this needs to be to their chest. This guy's chest is sort of an accursed thing. I'm gonna lay him down. All right, now that he's like attached, this guy should be fine to unfreeze. Man, just stay calm, sir. I'm gonna bring you back to life. Just stay calm. Everything's gonna be fine. <laughs> Turn it off. Not when I'm about to bring him back to life! <laughs> oh! Fuck. <laughs> Live, damn it! He needs blood! He needs a lot of blood! He needs more blood! That's what he needs! He needs blood! We need to give him more blood. I need a donor. I need a donor for the blood. I need a donor that'll give us blood. You are... You've lived long enough. Pull blood. Pull the blood right out of him. We need more. We need it faster. Faster, damn it. Faster. We need more blood. Shut up. <laughs> We're gonna need more blood. Is that all you got, man? Is that all you got? Is that all you got, man? That's all the blood he's got. All right. I'm sorry, but we also might need your organs. We're gonna have to eat your bones and then cut you open like a fucking fish. Bones are gone. His bones are all gone. His blood is infected. It doesn't chat. No, it isn't. Okay. Oh, Jesus. No, it isn't. This guy's done. Get the hell out of here. All right. So now I get another blood wire. Going into this guy on push. Clear. I said clear! Live, damn it, live! I need the life syringe. I need the life syringe again. Where's the life syringe? Man! You ain't dying on me, not like this, man! Live! He's alive! Well, he's definitely got blood now, so we don't need this anymore. How? I, I'm, I'm not giving up on this guy. I'm not giving up on this guy. I'm not giving up on this guy. He can't breathe. What do you mean? He's... How do I connect him with flesh? <laughs> I know it's not his head. All right, I know these are different people. Okay, hang on. Cut this one. Let's see it. Maybe the head's alive. Maybe that one's alive. Are you alive, man? Answer's no. Okay, let me ask. What about... Now... Man, like, how the hell's that head even got a... Oh, God, it's flailing. That was dark. The head has a heartbeat. Okay, first thing I need to do right now is lock this thing down, because this guy's bouncing all over the place. Shut up. Freeze. I need two monitors. I need one on each part. You're right, chat. I need I need this one. All right. So freeze. This one. Delete that. Okay, one will be the head, one will be the other one. 
All right. Body. Head. And he's not going to squirm as much because that's going to hold him down. Now, sir, I'm going to need you to stay calm, okay? I'm going to need you to stay calm. That's why I'm roping you down. Can't have you moving during the operation. No more flailing, sir. Now, what I'm going to do, okay, what I'm going to do is defib his head and his body at the same time. Clear. Live, damn it, live! Okay, all right, chat. He needs a neck. I can't give him a neck. Uh, how do I make a neck? Maybe these things aren't working. Maybe they need more power. Don't, don't do that. Don't do that. Mending. You're right, maybe I use a mending thing. Hang on. You're right, mending. Another mending syringe. This will bring his neck back. Sir, remain calm. Please. Arise, neck. Arise. Ar arise. This isn't working. We're bringing him back to life again. We'll just leave it. We're gonna keep working on it, but I'm gonna leave him. Oh, he's like trying to fight it off. I'm gonna leave him alive for now. Oh, I have an idea. If I turn him, wait. <laughs> yes. Arise. Arise, my child. Yes. 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 Arise. I mean, like, you, you are alive, right? You are right. Uh, you are you're alive, technically. He's alive. Look at that. He's like a he's like a old timey uh, gorilla kind of thing now. Uh, he probably just needs to, another life syringe. It's not like he can die. Life syringe will bring him back to life, a hundred percent. And uh, now he'll be a okay forever. We're a doctor. That was some scary music. Someone has gamer posture, dude. Chat, that's fucking funny. That's goddamn... What's in the pink syringe? Nobody's sure what's in this syringe. Uh, its effects appear inconsistent and unique to each container. It is pink. And now that you are officially immortal, it's time for you to do what you were born to do. Test the pink syringe. You are alive, right? Both of you? Yep. So, uh, what's, uh... It's his blood, he's beating pretty fast, his heart. Looking at the blood rate. His head's beating more blood down to his body than vice versa by, like, double the speed. His body's stiff. Yeah, I don't know how to unstiffen a man's body other than like a massage. Um. I order you to walk. I don't think he's conscious. I need to make him conscious again. Some adrenaline might help. I actually limbered him up. 
Okay, maybe I do. Hang on. These two are immortal. I could probably do a reconnection of the wires if I pause the game really quick. Okay, let me just hang on. Hold up. Delete. Delete. Move this. Now we just sort of... There we go. Now we just sort of do it again. Yeah, this is better. Look at that. Wasn't this the brainless version? He has no motor function. Even without a brain, you can, like, order them to do things. And now... Okay. Wait, did I ever take his bones? That might be part of the problem. Look, no, no, no. He's, he's got a beating heart. Look at his heart's moving. Okay. I order you... I order you... To... S he's not even awake. He's not even awake. Alright, this guy's unconscious. What the fuck? He's completely dead! Alright, hang on. Where's the fucking life syringe? All of his parts are broken. I need to heal his bones. <sighs> I'm not a good doctor, I don't think. Uh, fucking, was it the pink one? What's tritium? Maybe this one will do it. Ar arise. Uh, what's, um, I made him invincible. How is he not? Man, I've had about enough of this. I curse you with the zombie virus, but only the head. The body <laughs> will remain dead forever. Oh wait, all of it's turning green. I think that might be the tritium though. Look, this is a problem for like whoever lives in the depths. This ain't even a me problem, goodbye. I can't believe my fucking first god, I cannot believe he died. I, I can't believe I lost him. I tried so goddamn hard. I blew it. My, my, I'm gonna lose my license. Chat. I want to bulk delete things that I select, really badly. Like I don't. I want to be able to wipe, and then click delete. And uh, delete button doesn't do it. You can. Whenever I right click something li like this, it just makes them all disappear. That or this is technically it. Oh, okay. I thought it was like highlight. I thought I need to highlight it. Uh, okay. So what did this thing actually like do? A big gun. Wow, that's very pretty. All right. I need another person that's alive. I need another man. This one, I want to have a brain. Stay. That's hey, hey, hey. Calm down. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> Whenever a doctor connects a fucking beat, like a fucking thing like that for both, like two parts of your body, that's a bad sign. That's a really bad sign. All right, sir. So here's the thing. I need you to test out pink syringe. I know, I know. It's gonna be fine, just stay calm. How'd that do for you? Yeah? Yeah? I need you to turn pink, sir. Did you do anything? It's, his heart rate's getting a little weird. It's out of sync on both sides. The pink one regenerates over time, which is strange. He just bucked it off of him that time. His heart rate synced again. All right, sir. Um, do you feel different? You feel anything? 
I'm going to use... What the hell was that? I don't know. Uh... So what happens if I... What happens if I give him, like, something like a... I don't know. Fuck that. You know, I think exotic liquid... We never really checked this one. Because this one, like, exploded the second I tried it. What does that do to a man? He's trying to die. He's going... He's trying to get to the pit. I don't think he wants to be here anymore. He's, I think he's in pain. Makes him want to walk. What the hell just happened? Sir? His heartbeat is fine. Strap him to a chair. You're right. He's not... This isn't safe for him. I'm gonna get him on a uh, bus chair. Sir, sit the hell down! Turn around and sit down! I don't think he, he's that chilled him out. The second I put the chair down, he was fine. All right, good. Now, I need to identify what liquids are actually. I know, I know. Also, I got you right where I want you. Sit the hell down. Where'd the fire come from? Also, what, uh, what's this even connected to? This says that something has a heartbeat and it's not him because he's a dead body. No, he had one. You filled him with oil. I didn't fill him with oil. Can I, like, inject this from here? No. What a worthless fucking item. Lost another one. <sighs> what a fucking rotten way to die. What a rotten way to die. There's nothing we could have done. Hang on. Can we hydraulic press? Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me right now. Alright guys, it's time to do some hydraulic pressing. Everyone loves this stuff. People love this stuff. I'm gonna make it wide and big. Oh yeah. Hey, man, it's not moving. Oh, it's paused. Did I set to follow this? Wait. Okay, one of these needs to be frozen. Move it. Man, this needs to be, like, longer, too. It's not very... It's not a very long thing, is it? Like, this is, like, a hydraulic press for, like, a small rat. Whatever. It'll... It'll work. It'll work for what I need. Freeze. I need... Wait, is this part frozen? I need this part frozen. There we go. There it is. All right. Let's put someone in it and see what happens to their body. That'll be... That's something. I can do that. Ah, uh, this guy. A criminal. A guy who does crime. Wow, it squished. I almost put a guy that can actually process what's happening to himself. All right, cool. All right, he's in. He's in. Uh, all right, next, uh, we're going to make him uh, unable to die and very alive. Hang on, is this guy already dead? I think I broke his neck. Get, get another one. Sir, please gently go under the presser. He's smashing his head against it, but that's not going to save him. Uh, here we go. Giving him ultra strength syringe. Arise! Uh, he should be incredibly durable. Alright, that sort of did it. I'm not done with you yet, though. I'm going to need a life syringe on him. There you go. Sir, please. Calm down. I still need to actually test the fun part. Oh, 
Are you fucking kidding me? This guy leaked? Turn the generator off! Sir? Sir? Sir, please calm down, sir. It's not a... Sir, is he still alive? Is the thing. Sir, I need to... I need to... This guy... All right, this isn't gonna work if he's moving. You need to chill out, sir. Okay, that's better. Okay. Life syringe, I'm trying to help him. There it is. Back in mint condition. Arise, leg. Arise and look around at your new life. Huh. I'll turn this leg into a zombie. Arise. Like... That's alive! Take it to the bank, that leg's alive. Other ones don't stand up like- okay. Okay, so now I want to put something like funny in there, like a uh... Like a silly bomb. Like a- like a- like a fucking... Like an artillery shell. Can I get more fucking power on this thing? I'm gonna need to juice it. Wow. That fucking destroyed the generator. I'm gonna make this thing indestructible. Um, can I like fr I need to freeze this. You stay right there. Try atom bomb. God damn it. I need this thing to be like fucking perfect condition too. It's like breaking instantly. Oh, my zombie! God damn it. Does disable heat damage will help? It's not even that hot here. Chat, it's just it's one generator. It's not even that hot. Yeah, let me let me let's ask the goddamn let's ask the game. How hot is it in here, game? It's It's 56 Fahrenheit. 60 Fahrenheit. 61 Fahrenheit. See, that's not even that hot. It could be 10 times hotter. We're using copper wiring, which isn't really ideal. Probably want the good stuff. Okay, so I've made it pretty hot because now this thing's taking all the power. Okay, we probably want to make this thing, uh, disable heat damage in the future, but first we need to, like, make a new one. This one's broken now. Oh, there we go. Yeah? Wow. Wow. Okay. Good news is the thermometer can take it, and this isn't even close to the hottest it could be. Alright? Is it actually that hot, like, around here, though? Let's ask this guy. Sir, is it, like, hot in the area, or is this because it's wired? Uh, it's not that hot. That's from the- that's from the generator doing its thing. Now, uh, sir, what happens if I do this? Get that out of here! Get that the hell out of here! Just get it out of here. Just getting that out of here. 
Oh! Okay, now I am going to connect another generator to this thing this time. I want to know how much hydraulically I can do. Uh. Uh. I don't even know if these stack, but we're going to ask our friend Gorse. We're gonna ask our friend Groose. Okay, people are exploding so fast I can't process what happened to them. I'm gonna ask our friend, world-renowned character, Minecraft, Minecraft, Minecraft Steve. That wire is the only thing that tells me there used to be a Minecraft Steve there. I don't know exactly what to do. Um, well, the, look, the hydraulic, this was cool. I think it's time to retire the press. It's time to retire the press. Let that thing cool off. Now, uh, what else we got here? Rotor, shock detector, Tesla coil. Uh,. Let me get rid of this first. I was really dreading that. I was worried that was going to be worse. That's not that bad, even with all the power. I don't even think these really stack. Yeah, this ain't that bad. I'm going to put this guy with the SWAT suit near it. Okay, I just that broke it because of the because of the heat. Which I was expecting to happen. Alright, hang on. Alright, alright, alright. I want to raise the latent temperature of the whole map. How do I do it hard and fast? A thruster bed? Like, does that, is that going to boost the latent temperature? Nuke. I don't know, Chad. I don't know if I want to nuke. Hang on. I have an idea. If I'm going to nuke, the first thing I'm going to do is put a bunch of people... Was that a spoon? Okay, uh, I'm gonna put a bunch of people in the basement that can all think. Okay, because I want to see if they live. Why is this guy green? Alright, my people. Live in your basement society. Live your lives. Un unknowing of what awaits anyone that comes to the surface. Like these fucking idiots. Looking over there at the strange experiments that have been happening all day. Set this to a nice slow speed as we do this. Where the hell's the nuke? I need the nuke. There, hang on. I don't see a nuke. There is a heating element. That's fucked up. Hang on. Heating element. Okay, chat. So I'm going to get us a couple of heating elements. And I'm going to set these all to not take any... Oh yeah, I want to set this to a target temperature of 1,000. Okay. And I'm going to freeze them all. And I'm also going to make sure they're all as powerful as they can be. Alright. I'm going to turn them on. On, on, on. On, on, on. I'm going to... Just sort of on, 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 on. Only a thousand degrees. That's actually not that bad. But we'll see how fast it heats up on the thermometer. I mean, not fast. Like, all right, here's how we test this, okay? How long can a guy just sort of stand here? You know? Let me just get a guy, like this guy. He's gonna stand here near them. And I'm gonna hook him up to a, the blood wires so that I know if he's like, you know, starting to not like it. 69 beats per minute. You gotta turn on ambient heat transfer. I do have that on. I literally have that on. 
but it's on. Man, he's getting his beat. It's all, it's an 86 Fahrenheit. This is me normally in my office. I don't even think it's gonna get any higher than that. This is as hot as it ever got. 86, my thermometer's right on it. Fan, maybe. Yeah, maybe if I, like, turn on a fan. Yeah. We put in more. All right, it's now 200 degrees Fahrenheit. Just by adding those, and they didn't even, I didn't even set them to their actual proper desired temperature yet. I want them to be at 1,000 degrees. All right. How are you, sir? Uh, let me now add a uh, thermometer like here. I have the ambient thing on, and it's only 89 right now over here. It's like 100 degrees. This guy's fine. Is there anything we have for, like, heat? Heat? Heat ray? I mean, if I spray this sort of nearby, it might boost the temperature overall. Hotter. It's 106 degrees. It's getting hotter. I'm adding more. I'm adding more of them. All you turn on. I'm raising the stakes until this guy explodes. I'm not stopping until he burns to death and dies. All right, I don't care. Target temperature. 1,000 degrees! 115 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, we'll come back to this guy, all right? Actually, I mean, I guess, I guess he's sort of like the current project. I can't really come back to him later. 116 degrees. He's getting to the point now. Resize. Oh my god, you're right. It's a good fucking idea, chatlet. You're right. Set target temperature, 1,000. Okay. Make it big now. 117. Just uh, make it any hotter for you, man? Is this bothering you yet? And now I'm gonna set a big generator. This is the large generator, the large wide generator. This one's the one I use for all my big emergencies. 120, 121. Man, it's really hard to heat a room this big. Well, that's actually like a good question. Uh, how hot is it like over here? We're losing so much heat. And it's got these people just watching and have no idea what to say. How could they say anything? 123. You need a heat transfer pipe. I don't want to transfer heat to this guy. That's not going to help. Transfer heat to the ground. I don't want to If I transfer it to him, he's just going to blow up. Make some insulating walls. How? I need to box him in. Here we go, brick cubes. All right, here we go, brick walls. Yeah, I got, I got a plan. All right, I got a plan. I'm gonna brick, I'm gonna wall this guy in. Go to the environment tab. I feel like making up tabs. There is no environment. Oh, you mean here? Access the environment settings. Ooh. All right, the ambient temperature to help us out a little bit is now 150 degrees. 
Fucking eat shit. All right. All right, man. Oh my God! The people in the basement. The people in the basement. The pe Guys. All right, they're all fine. It's gonna be a hundred degrees from now on. Uh, as as we go forward. Eee! All right, get this all the hell out of you. I'm gonna set off the nuke. But I'm gonna set it off like over here. Wait, an explosive that absorbs all energy in the environment and violently releases it. There's no energy here. I deleted it. Unless you're talking about spiritual energy, like the the energy those guys are giving off. See, I told you, there's like no energy, so it's pretty safe. See, it's not even dangerous. See, it's barely any. Guys? 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 Uh, how's the basement? Guys? They're fine. The basement dwellers are fine. The basement guys are fine. All right, all right, here's what we're gonna do. I'm going to take a uh, napalm bomb. Like so. I'm gonna put it right over this thing. I'm gonna set it off. I mean, I guess that won't, and none of that should reach the bottom, looks like. I don't really wanna light people on fire from way down there. That's sort of fucked up. Uh, where is, where's the, where's the nuke? I guess fusion bomb. All right, we'll just see what this does to a man. Okay? We'll see if this even reaches him. I'm doing the math here. They're fine. It, it incurring some burns. Okay, the second wave came. And now they're melting. Is it over? Can a man live in this... Oh, I closed the chat by accident. Oh no. Can a man live in this environment? He's fine. This is a world that a man can live in. Look, he's fine. Oh, that's fucking ominous. That's a uh, really grim there. Just look at the, you turn around the darkness, it's like spoon, and then the, the, the shadows return to the land. Oh my god. What the hell? Hang on, I'm fixing chat. There we go. Uh, what do we do now? Check out some of the other maps. Let's see what other maps there are. Snow, small, tiny, humongous, hybrid, void. What does that, what does void mean? Cause I thought I, I was in the abyss. What, what's void? Void is empty. Like it's just gonna like make the guy fall forever. That sounds about right. That's what I'm expecting. This poor fucking guy. Okay, well we're moving on to the next map. Uh, let's take a look at us, um, tiny. Let's go into the tiny map. Then I'll check out some blueprints if I can, like, get some online. Wow, this is tiny. How small is this? Welcome to my shithole, everyone! Thanks for joining me! Now I'm gonna place a bomb inside the room! Alright? And now I'm gonna put a... Now I'm gonna put a cube in the room to clean this up. I 
activated another one. I'm gonna see what happens. It's time to end the fucking world. The whole actual world is gonna end when I do this. It ate them. I mean, this is so much energy. I'm curious what the other bomb's gonna do. Okay, well, uh, now this world can be lived in again, which is good. Now we can, uh, you know, bring this guy. He's not even gonna know what happened right there. Will he, will this guy just, like, fucking pass away and die if I just, like, take all of his blood away and put it in the jars? He's, like, looking around at him. He doesn't know what's happening. I'm guessing he'll just die. Take his blood from him. Take his blood. I need this for later. Take his blood. All of you, take his blood. Take his blood. Take all of it. We're gonna need all of it. Oh, these are pushing. Take his blood. Get all of his blood out. You need all of it. Okay. Ooh, this is our nice. Put this on the ceiling so we can see while we're doing our psycho things. Freeze. How's that? Is that all of his blood? Man? It's all of his blood. We don't need these two. Get rid of these wires. We don't need those. Get these out of the way. Get them out of the way from there. Alright, man. I got a special plan for you. Oh, I broke his butt. The advanced gore option, please. It's not, I, there's an advanced, there's more gore, where? Man, please hold still. Apparently you have like organs now. Uh, give me a minute. I'll be the judge of that. I'm gonna need to freeze this. And I'm gonna need to freeze his legs. Now I'm just gonna sort of, <laughs> <laughs> Drop it! All right, I'm pulling out the hammer. This guy is fucking crazy. Maybe that's why I couldn't bring that guy back to life before. Because I couldn't... How was I supposed to... Okay, hang on, life syringe. Come back to me, guy. You're alive! He's alive, he's twitching. Look at him, he's looking around. Unfreeze him, unfreeze him. Well, I told you. Look at him. You guys can't believe it, but he lives. He lived. He's still alive, he's still twitching. Hang on, let me get it, I gotta get another fucking heart rate monitor. Hang on. Alive? Oh, he's alive. He hates it, but he's alive, okay? All right, sir. So the thing is, I need to check for organs in there. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to cut you open with the laser sword. I know. Sorry in advance. The laser sword just burns. This guy sucks, I need a new one. Clear it. Clear everything. Clear everything. Uh, we're gonna have to cut someone open. Uh, I choose, uh, you. And I'm gonna use this dark blade. That isn't what I fucking... That's not... I need... J just get the hell out of here. I, I'm gonna need another. I'm gonna get a couple. I just need a normal sword. Or I guess a bomb would do. Okay, you guys fucking stop it. Alright, just you. Just you, my guy. Now. Do 
Do I have to like re chat? It might be that I need to reload the game for like the uh, expanded gore to even happen. Because I don't see any of these organs. Try the other human, you think? Well, that was the. That, I, we did try the other humans before, didn't we? It'll only work on vanilla guys. All right. I'm going to try it. And at this point. I'm really gonna try it. Here we go. I want this face in the other way. Mm. I'm realizing now there's no way for skin to- I see his eyes. His eyes are there. I see him. Yeah, you're right. You're right. That's his eyes. <laughs> Googly eyes. All right. All right. There is, in fact, organs now. Which means I can finally resume my doctor business. I'm bringing back... I'm bringing in a birthday human. Happy birthday. Uh, 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 shit, now I have to check if he has fucking... Now I have to check if he has anything. He's, uh... Make some space. Organs... It is your birthday. Ah, it's one not happening. I got an achievement for that. Serial killer. I just got the serial killer one for killing three people. Apparently, none of the others counted. Oh, I got it! I just used a grenade! Alright, we're gonna check if the birthday guy has one. The birthday guy... Where the hell is he now? Birthday? Birthday boy. Alright. Oh, yeah, he's got him. He's, I can tell. I can tell a mile away he's got him. Okay, this guy's got organs. Attach generator to grenade. I don't know if I want to do that. I don't know if I want to do that. But I will. Probably. I will. Maybe if I can find the generator again, because I miss it every time I have it. Okay, freeze. Disable heat damage. I mean, a grenade's going to be pretty boring. Generator to android. That can't be good. This is not going to play out well. You happy? It's not like he was made for this. You guys just fucking made me kill that guy. Why? Why? You okay though? No, he isn't okay. None of them are okay. Generated a jukebox. Why am I worried that this is gonna like give me like a fucking horrible, horrible goddamn like DMCA song? Turn on. Oh! Ah, oh, he's he's dead. That man is dead. We killed him. You happy now? You killed him! How do I play the piano? I don't think I can use this thing. Get this guy out of here. Get him out of here. Now, the question is, can I electrically charge it? I want to make a balloon explode so hard it kills a man. I think that's pretty good. Happy birthday, man. It's his birthday. All right, it's, it's this guy's birthday. Remember, that's like the point. Happy birthday, man. Happy birthday. 
Happy for you. Happy fucking birthday. Happy birthday. Now, inject something into the balloon. That doesn't sound like that's going to work. I'm gonna inject acid into this balloon. So I feel like... I feel like that isn't gonna work. That pops it. Tomato has done this for three hours. Wrong! <laughs> you have no idea how long my fucking intros are, you freak! <laughs> Use blood wire for it. Hmm, that's pretty smart. That's pretty smart. You think it's gonna pay off? I don't think balloons have blood. Maybe if, maybe if we take advantage of gravity? Freeze you up there. You down there. No, this thing doesn't have blood. Now, if we did this, maybe, I got one idea that might work. I have one idea that might work. I'm gonna see if I can move this guy's blood into a balloon and make it explode like a fucking blood balloon. So hang on. Pull his blood out into blood. Okay, there's some blood. Seen some coming out of his, uh, out. All right. You got blood. Delete that. Now we wire the blood into the balloon. That was an electrical wire, isn't it? Push the blood into the balloon. This isn't going to work. This isn't, this isn't working. That guy lost all of his blood for no reason. <clears throat> what the hell is this? An industrial piston. It's time for you to die. Oh, this could get really cursed. An even more powerful version of the piston. Hang on, resize it. Oh my god. Stop resizing. Resize. I made a big mistake. Hang on, I need to reset this. I fucked it up. I fucked this up bad. Hang on, let me re let me do this again. I only need to resize the body. Because the rest of it stretches anyways. Perfect. Freeze it. Stop resizing. Behold! Now you die! And I might need to actually make it a little bit wider. I need to make this a little bit wider. Resize. Yeah, the balloons are gonna be a problem. Oh, this made it stuck in the ground. That works. It's how the blueprints work. How, how, what, what the heck's going on with those? How do I like check out what other people have made? I, I, I want to see what. Oh yeah, hang on. How do I check like where's the blueprints? I want to see what other people have made in this game. Is it like in the workshop? Because like it doesn't even let me filter to blueprints. Machines. Okay, I see some stuff. I see a tank. Choose a map. I, that's not how it works. Uh, mm. I, yeah, hydraulic press streams and what? Oh, I do see something. That apparently I downloaded like a psycho maniac without actually finding the way to activate it. Uh, called Torture Factory. Um, I... I need to have the beta enabled. Hang on, there might be a bunch of stuff I'm missing because I don't have the beta version of the game on. Give me a second, chat. Give me a second. I don't think I'm, I don't think I've ever used the beta. Apparently, I'm missing like beta features. Okay, I'm activating the beta. The beta is now enabled. It wasn't much content. 
in the beta. Oh, yeah, I do see some. Oh, wait, no, I don't. No, I don't. I thought I saw stuff, but I didn't. Uh, I mean, that might just be like, I got these things active. I got the mods. I got the mods. And Torture Factory. I don't see Torture Factory. Where the hell's Torture Factory? That was the one I downloaded. It's one of the tabs. So do I like spawn it in? Okay, I'm going to go to the default map. I think I like spawn it in as like an item. It must be a blueprint then. I go to like the save thing then. All right. So. Hang on. Let me just make sure this isn't going to like leave. Okay. Yeah, here we go. Torture factory. Okay. So this is what humans do with their free time. Is they make this. How do I, uh, hang on, he's not even at the top. Spawn, activate the button and spawn naughty humans here. Son? Son, what are you making in that video game, son? Oh, you know, mom, I'm, uh, I'm making a factory that I can use to torture, uh, people. I'm uploading as a blueprint to the workshop so other people can also use it. <laughs> this is psycho shit. This is insane. I'm making another one here because that guy didn't make it all the way down. Nothing, mother. I'm just making a factory I could use to torture NPCs in a video game. It's just a game, mom. It doesn't actually mean anything about me. But this doesn't, this doesn't, this doesn't mean anything. Mom, this is, I'm not crazy. It doesn't mean anything. I spent four, like, four days straight making this. But, uh, <laughs> They're still alive. They're still alive. Oh, the chainsaws are in bad taste. This guy didn't stand a chance. Factory might start off a bit buggy. But should automatically fix itself the generators after each floor work most of the time. Sometimes they mess or malfunction. Feel free to edit and toggle each floor to your heart's consent. Press the button to toggle the decimator. De Yikes, that's fucking... Okay. Uh, well, I've seen enough of this guy's murder mansion. So get that out of here. Uh, we have another thing. Skyscraper with realistic destruction. The only thing that's going to be realistic about this is how to, like, it just won't work. It's just like, this is going to... Yeah, well, those cars aren't a problem. So like, it, these have realistic destruction. And like, if I just like grab this guy's house right here and I fill it with a lot of bones, how'd that guy fucking die? How'd that guy die? I'm gonna fill this room with bones. Until it destructs. Okay, that didn't even make anything destruct. Alright, I'm gonna fill it with, uh, artillery shell. That'll do it. Realistic destruction, my ass! What are you talking about? Now all the bones are just spilling into the next floor. Realistic destruction. I've seen more. I, I, I bet Pink Bomb does more realistic ex destruction. Okay, there we go. That was better. Man, Pink Bomb's a dangerous one, chat. What the hell? God, there's so much in this game, and it's like, it's genuinely overwhelming, you know what I mean? Like, there's all this crap. I don't know what just happened there. I didn't, that wasn't me. I'm trying to drag, I'm trying to delete these things. I mean, I'll use to clear everything. There's, like, there's so much. Connect syringe with blood tank using blood wire. You can make custom syringes using these fluids and empty syringe. I, yeah, but like, what is, like, I could also just inject them at the same time and see what happens. Like, uh, I'm not entirely sure that's going to change much, you know? But why though? 
But why would I do that, though? I don't, I'm not sure exactly why I would. This game gets complex if you want. I mean, I don't dislike it. I can tell you that much. It's really interesting. Uh, I'm not entirely sure. Like, Chad, what do I do? Is like, there anything I like need to do in this game that I should? I have to, like, bro, you have to see this thing. You know what I mean? Try the utmost right tab. That's SCP. That, oh, that's not SCP. What the hell is this? A piece of Zothra's soul. Hey, man. Can you eat this? Man? Pick that up. What, uh, what does this soul do for you? Allows some of the gifted to reach their full potential. Okay, I'm going to slightly improved human. Okay, that's a slightly improved human right there. This guy's nothing. Delete him. And over here, I'm going to put a human with a brain. All right, facing that way. So what is a... All right, slightly improved human. I want you to... Uh, I want you to go berserk, honestly. How do I... Where's the go crazy button? Inspect? What's it? All right. All right. Stronger than an average human. That's whatever. Replicator infects other humans. How the hell does that work? Like, if I touch him? I'm sort of confused what these do. What, is that, what, is this, what does this do? You have to use the script. Activate. What do you mean? Well, he, in, he turned into something. Activate. What is this guy even? I know you can, like, activate some parts of them. Whoa! What the hell are you? What the fuck was that? Uh, make another guy. Make this guy. Okay, this thing's a problem. He's gonna be a problem for the group. The script in the first tab. Auto activator for the script. How do I know what that's like on? Spawn this object and the script will be active until the map change or restart. Okay, I, I spawned it. They're li alive! I've been playing the game all wrong! Get him! Yeah, beat the shit out of each other! It's all, this whole time I didn't even know this existed. All right, now, uh, now, you get them. All right, he's out of there. Okay, he's already been... Wow, you can see, like, the mess on his body. He's... That's some fucking... That replicator guy's fucked up. Look at that. You can actually see it now. Okay, and now I'm summoning an absorber. This guy... Uh, this guy eats people. Now get them. No, 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 no. Where are you going? Get them. He, like, hurt his leg really bad. I'm gonna make another absorber to get them, then. Absorb each other. That guy's trying... Okay, these guys... What the hell happened to that guy's leg? Oh my god, he's being absorbed! Oh my god! The absorbers just absorbed each other! That one's the strongest absorber. I don't know what they're doing. I'm gonna go to the next guy. Uh, causes internal bleeding in nearby enemies. Okay. Hang on. These people... Alright, they like squirming. These guys really like... They all like squirming. I need them... I need the small room. I, I gotta go back to small room. I can't do this in... I gotta go back to like the smaller room. They're all squirming. They aren't in berserk mode. Some of them don't even like have a berserk mode button. Like, so you're like telling me to do things that aren't even possible. Like, some of them, I, I guess maybe because I'm not select, because I'm... Why do they have it now? No, you guys saw I went down here and it wasn't there before. Like, what what changed? Like, genuinely. I want, I want to know. The script wasn't on. But that's weird, because I didn't activate it one other time earlier today and it was there. Maybe I, like, accidentally started the script. Okay, man. So, I want you... 
to be cool and go berserk at the first guy you see, which is also a guy. All right, let's see what he does. The other one's trying to run. It's just a fist fight. Oh, that was a bad slap to the back. He's trying to hold him back with his legs. Um, I think it's over. Right, this guy lost. This, this, he broke his leg. Right, let, let's clear this. Hang on. What do we? So what do we have here? Can take away, store, and transfer the abilities of gifted humans. Is this guy technically a gifted human? So if I give him a piece of Zothra's soul, what happens? Here, eat this. Where's a, who's a gifted human? He's not gifted. Well, that's fucking mean. The glowing guys are gifted. Alright, so this guy, Ladrigo, is gifted. Alright, Ladrigo. Oh, okay, Ladrigo. Um, so what happens? Ladrigo, get that guy. Alright, go berserk and kill that guy. Kill that guy, kill him. Okay. Uh, pretty dark stuff. This guy gives low tier humans powers. Or he gets immediately grabbed by the fucking Grundle with a rear hand swing and uh, uh, vaporized by the guy. This guy's fucking crazy. Okay, I need to find a way to stop him. Uh, the great champion. Of course. He's the strongest warrior in entire. Okay. Happy now? You're happy what happened? Look at what happened. Look around you. Now I gotta summon the shell to, cl to kill you. Alright, now I gotta summon the shell to take your life. I'm not entirely sure what the shell does. But I think he wants him. He really wants to grab him. He's doing like, I think he's actually like stuck in the air. He doesn't know how to get down. He like just discovered he could fly. Like, let's be honest, Chad, if you started flying and you, like, didn't know why, you'd f freak out, right? Like, if this started happening to you, you'd be like, oh, oh, you'd start panicking so fucking bad. You wouldn't be like, that's epic. You'd be like, oh, fucking God, I'm going to, it's over. All right, so this guy is God. Okay, he proved it. He proved it really quick. There. So, uh, what happens? Hey, God. Hey, God, what happens if I inject you with, uh, with fucking... Where is it? With the pink syringe. God? What, uh, what's gonna happen, God, if I inject you with the pink syringe? Are you injection-proof? That's not gonna do. Stay right there. That's fine, God. That's fine. That's fine. I respect the hustle. I respect the hustle not, he said, opening up the blood tank. I'm filling this uh, tank with pink. And I'm going to advance time by four times while I do it. I'm going to fill, I'm filling this blood with uh, this tank with pink. Um, I'm filling this up with concentrated pink. Huh. I didn't know I had a cure thing and the heal bones move. Wait a minute. Pressure? No, I, let's see if this guy can even feel pain. All right. I don't want time to go back to normal. How do I disable a power? How do I... Chad, I don't want time on anymore, but it says it's still on. How do I go back to my life? Click another thing. I did, like... Oh, there we go. Okay. I don't want a power. Oh, oh I gotta put it back on drag. Okay. Delete that. Delete this. Now I'm going to... I'm gonna inject this guy with pink. 
and see what happens. Push the pink directly into his body. We're going to need more than one line. This guy's a big boy. All right, God. I guess a lot of pink in his body. So, uh, what happens now? Nothing, I don't think. Unfreeze? You're right, I should unfreeze him. It's not fair. God, calm down. It's just some pink. It's just Pepto Bismol. Calm down. All right. All right. All right, I've seen enough of this tantruming. I'm giving you one chance to apologize for making a scene in front of my chat. One chance. This is going to be really dark chat. And I apologize for that. This is gonna be really dark, cause uh... God? God, man? Man? Oops. Freeze those, turn them all on. Make them all resistance to temperatures, too. And, uh, connect them all to this thing. There he goes, now he's back alive! Oh my god, he's still here! Okay, well, now we have a way to clean up basically any problem. A human with an implant. He... Okay, all right, all right, all right. Enemy of humanity. Let's see if the enemy of humanity can keep up with this. The answer is no. All right, let's see if the shell can keep up with it. All right, no one can really keep up with all this. Uh, is good. That's good. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Heal this guy for me. Hey, heal this guy. Hey. Heal him. Heal him. Arise. God, oh, he's coming back. Don't worry. Hey, this thing, this guy's done. Wait, I fixed his bones. Hang on, I might be able to fix his bones. Flat pose, I don't even know what that means. Uh, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna mend his bones. I'm gonna, I'm gonna set him, reset all of his animations. This guy's done, his, bone, his bones are, I don't even think his bones are in there because he's wiggling, his knees are going in different directions. I think his joints are fucked. That guy's dead. And I can't even get rid of him. Well, I mean, I can. I can't get rid of him. I can get rid of all of him, technically. How the fuck did his brain survive? That's his brain. Right? That's his brain. Go away! Uh, maybe just flush it again. What? What? How, uh, how's, how's this thing still alive, though? Uh, life syringe. 
Hang on. Hey, good news is I can't bring it back to life. Which is probably for the best, honestly. Good. That's fine. Pulse check. You're right. You're right. This isn't, it's not fair to assume. We need to be sure. For his sake, I'm a doctor, goddammit. I'm gonna make sure this guy's actually dead. Okay, it doesn't even think that this is a, like a living thing. That's just a brain. Guys, it's just a brain. It doesn't even have a pulse. I'm really, I don't really understand this. Who the fuck? Dwayne! Keep him away from Zothra's soul and everything will be fine. Dwayne, I'm giving you Zothra's soul. Dwayne, you're, you're making a real fool of yourself right now. I'm gonna have to call in the shell. Okay, the shell lost. I'm calling out our official god again. That's not a black hole. The hell is, uh, what is that? Uh, what is this? What is this? Dwayne? Ah, oh, fuck. He left his brain here and his eyeballs. Pulse check. Nah, this, I think this one's dead. But you know what? The the rotten god can probably disintegrate this flesh for us. Or not. Alright, Dwayne. Where the hell's Dwayne again? Dwayne, get in here. Okay, so the rotten god is better than Dwayne. But, I mean, it looks like Dwayne is still alive. Even without his bones and flesh. I'm giving him Zothra's thing again. So, wait, is Dwayne actually still alive? Here, Dwayne. Take the... Take the... Yeah, Dwayne's still alive. He just went into ultra... He just went into super mode. And now I'm gonna summon slightly improved human into the... F I'm bringing in slightly improved human into the... F Let's give it up for everyone's favorite guy. Improved human. I'm... I'm calling him in. It's finally happening. Ladies and gentlemen. The duality elemental. Ladies and gentlemen, the artificial god. Huh? What happened to the soul of Dwayne? Dwayne? Who's eating that? Uh, someone's eating the... Okay, how do I clean... How do I clean up this mess? Then, I have an idea. I have a plan, Chad. We'll just use... We'll just use another thermonuclear explosion. You gotta be fucking kidding me, God! You, come on! Alright, maybe he... Maybe this one. No, that doesn't do any better. Maybe napalm. That actually did it. Guys, if you need to kill God, just use normal napalm. Got him. No. No. His head's still alive. Get the hell out of here. I can't inject him with things. He's too strong. Yeah, this is a 100% alive head right here. He's got a broken bone. He's 24% burnt, but he's all right. He actually fucking just healed, I think, right in front of me. He's a robot, you can't stab it. I mean, he seems pretty mad still. What is he like bouncing around for? 
Why does it? This guy ain't a robot. Why the hell? Oh, he actually might be a robot. Hang on. The machine. Yeah, yeah. This might be like a machine sort of thing. We'll just summon the void boy. Dude. Bro? What just happened to him? His, his whole body is disintegrating. Can I get a pulse check on this guy? We'll, we'll give him the soul. That made it even worse. Uh, Alright, we're just gonna feed all this to the absorber. He can handle all this. Eat him. Eat that guy. Eat him. Okay, this is robots. I'm, I'm gonna black hole it. I'm getting rid of him. We're just gonna, we're gonna black hole it. Get rid of these guys. Uh, make everything a little bit better. Will an energy vessel do it? No. That just made him stronger. I can't believe it's not a black hole. Oh, there is a black hole bomb. Okay, everything's taken care of again. No problem. So I have like powers, huh? Fire lightning bolts by flicking across the screen. Wow, fancy fireballs. Fucking lift, arise! All right, this game's pretty neat. We're uh, we're done though. We're we're done though. We're gonna be, we're gonna be done though. We're gonna be done though on this one for tonight. The uh, my, the sun the th the sun thing isn't uh, able to keep me alive anymore, and I think that's about all the fun we're gonna get out of this right now. I like this. This was funny. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow. And three, can you build the portal? What are you talking about? What portal? Is there, like, something I need to do last minute that, like, I have to see? Like, bro, you have to see this? There are Easter eggs. Well, maybe that's the thing I'll do later when, like, there's more... I don't know, when there's more I want to go back to. It's convoluted. Well, then it sounds like something I can't do. Uh, we'll figure... I'll, I'll look into it. I'm gonna go, uh, I'm gonna go take it easy, and, uh, I'll be back tomorrow. I'm really sleepy. I can't do any more chat. It's over. It's over! I'll be back, uh, I'll be back tomorrow at 3 p.m. It's your 3.30. I don't know. I've been slipping a little bit later lately. I've just been fucking start. Look. All right, look. Whatever. Gazian, thanks for the $5. Hey, Tomato, you ever thought about playing I, Divine Cybermancy? Maybe one day. Oh, also, my voice sucks. Chat, that's the other thing. I don't know if you noticed. I can't even do the high-pitched voice right now. I'll be back tomorrow, and I'll be doing D&D &D after my stream tomorrow. And go get some rest. Get some food. Survive. Tomorrow, uh, is gonna be something maybe a little spooky. Tomorrow, this, tomorrow might be something a little bit, a little bit, a little bit spooky, I think. I'll see you then. Goodbye. <laughs>